Stuck for ideas for the perfect gift? Why not get them a gift card? You can buy Sewing Street and Yarn Lane gift cards loaded up with anything from £10 to £500. Shop our gift cards online at www.sewingstreet.com or www.yarnlane.com or purchase them via our UK call centre on 0800 001 4433. Have you heard about all of the different ways you can shop with Sewing Street and Yarn Lane? You can either shop on our websites sewingstreet.com and yarnlane.com. You can also order by phone by calling our friendly UK customer service team. For Sewing Street, call 0800 001 4433. And for Yarn Lane, call 0800 4700 600. And don't forget about the Sewing Street app. Here you can shop all of the Sewing Street products as well as watch the live shows from anywhere. You can download the app onto your smartphone or your tablet by simply searching Sewing Street in your app store. And one final thing, no matter how many times you check out on Sewing Street or Yarn Lane in one day, you will only pay one postage and packaging. Happy shopping! Good morning, good morning, good morning. Now, before we start, no, the app isn't working. No, you can't buy on the website. And what was the other thing, Han? Oh, the menu's not working. I can't show you the menu either. Uh, but apart from that, everything's fine. So, should we do the early bird? There we go, early bird. Now, you've seen the advert. Uh, bigger quantities, special prices, exciting early birds. Well, today is no exception. Look, you're getting four tape measures. Now, at the moment, they're a pound each, right? 3 99 so that'd be a pound each. You get a pound for the um, narrow one, a pound for the medium-sized one, a pound for the wide one, and a pound for the retractable one. 3 99 for a four-piece tape measure set, right? Let me just open it all up for you. But it's the early bird, special prices. Right, hang on a second. Say that again. Yeah, right, yo. So, you get the nice, thick, chunky one there. Oh, I haven't got no head. Nice, thick, chunky one there. You get the lovely... Well, that's your normal one. That's your normal width one there. And then you get your lovely narrow one there. And your retractable one there. Should be three ninety nine. Now, the only way you can buy is by ringing the call centre. 0800-001-4433. It's a free, fa- it's free, you don't pay for it, right? And they're upstairs, so they're waiting to take your call. And they know, 199, call now, call now, call now. Because once you've pa- you bought your early bird, and you've paid your P&P on that, that's it for the rest of the day, whether you come, oh, I'll tell you in a minute. Uh, whether you're coming to buy a machine, whether you're coming to buy the fabric, got the first step. Now, I've got to also tell you, CL is poorly, so CL won't be in today. We've got Becky here from Crafter's Companion, but uh, CL will not be in today. I do apologise about that. She says, I spoke to her last night, she said she feels rotten and gutted that she's not here and she'll rebook as soon as possible. Uh, so the only way you can buy is by ringing the call centre, 0800 001 4433. Oh yeah, if you want, you want to, yeah, we have a huge stock of this, so it won't sell out. It won't sell out yet. It'll sell out later, because yesterday sold out, didn't it, Han? Yesterday sold out. Can't remember what it was yesterday. Uh, H-O-D-X-13. H-O-D-X-13. Because maybe what you want to do is write down all the things you want, and then ring up and go, I want this, 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 and this sort of thing. £1.99 for four tape measures. One's retractable. You get a narrow one, a medium one, and a wide one. And a lovely retractable one there. Don't know why I'm doing it like that. All oh, those tape measures. You know what she reminds me of? What's that mythical creature? And she's got snakes in her hair. Medusa. I hadn't knew what I was going to say. Uh, Marie says, good morning. Irene says, the app isn't working. No, I'm afraid it's not. Pam says, good morning. 
No, Carol, the web's not working today. It's not just us. It's all of our sister channels. So, uh, Jewelry Maker, Gems, none of them. None of them have got it. Hobby Maker hadn't had it this morning. Morning, last day with you for a while. I'm having my hip replaced tomorrow. Oh, Leslie, you take care, my love. Tracy says hello. Hilary says hello. I will enjoy my holiday, but I'm keeping my fingers crossed because there's so many flights not going, are there? aren't there? Tried watching through the web, but says server error. Yes, sorry, not on. YouTube also not working. All right, Claire. Will you do me... Was it Claire that just asked that? No, it wasn't. Claire just said good morning. Viv, Viv, do me a favour. Go to the Yarn Lane YouTube and see if it's on there. That's what was happening the other day. Judy says good morning. Kirst says good morning. Getting over a cold, but hubby's got one now. I've been trying the website. No joy, says Kate. No, it's not working. You won't know if you'll be able to get it. Have you jinxed the rest so you look smaller on my phone? No, Viv. Um, hello, good morning, lovely John Suzanne. Gaynor says, John, I can only watch on Facebook. Other ways to watch not working. Telly? We're not on the telly. We're on the telly. Lynn says, sorry, there are problems, Lynn. Uh, Lynn. Oh, don't worry, Lynn. We're used to it now. Uh, June says, good morning, lovely shirt. Thank you. Anne says, morning, John and team. Marcy is watching. Oh, Marcy made me the most beautiful birthday present. Oh, it's on Yarn Lane. If you go to YouTube on Yarn Lane, it's there. We're on, you we can watch us on YouTube on the Yarn Lane channel. Not on the Yarn Lane website, on the Yarn Lane cha uh, YouTube channel. Patricia says, loving you. Thank you, Patricia. Good morning, says Jenny. Marcia says, good morning. Right, four tape measures for £1.99. Only way to buy is by the phone, 0800 001 4433. Write down the code, we'll repeat it again later. Hopefully, oh, it'll get sorted, but it's not an internal thing. It's external, apparently. So we can't do anything about it. I mean, obviously, we can make phone calls, but it's not us that are going to fix it. £1.99. Only way to buy, on the phone, 0800 001 4433. And she's with us. Jojo says lots of sites down this morning. Oh, lots of sites, not just the Gems family. Twitter's down, apparently. We've just been told that. We've just been told that. Twitter's down. Um, loving your shirt, says Nina. Thank you. And she says, morning. Hope you had a lovely birthday. I did indeed. Thank you. Well, I was here, wasn't I? But I did indeed. I don't have Sky, John. I've got Virgin. Oh, Gaynor. It's on Freeview. It's on Freeview. Oh, watch how you're watching now. Uh, yeah, I'm up to date with my messages. One ninety nine. Early bird. Can I also just tell you while I'm still... Oh, no, I'll wait, I'll wait, I'll wait. I'll wait. Yeah, yeah, I'm just waiting with you because people are obviously taking a bit longer than just clicking on the button. You've got to ring up, haven't you? Leanne, good morning, John. Had a lovely time with Jane Green off in Leeds at the weekend. We spoke about you. Oh, did you? And what a lovely man you are. Oh, thank you. Karen says, get on with... Can't get on the website. No, it's not working. It's not working. You're a little behind on Yarn Lane. Thank you. Uh, got you on the big telly via Yarn Lane, says Kim. Brilliant. Lisa says, I can watch. Oh, now Lisa can watch on the app. Lisa is watching on the app. So maybe it's fixing itself. Morning, John. Love your shirt, says Laurie. Sue says, lots of websites are down this morning. Wonder what it is. Have we been, do you think we've been, um, I don't know what the word is. And I'm going to get political, so I won't. Because I'm rubbish at political things. But I'm just thinking, get cyber. I think we've been cybered. Is that the word? Yeah, broken, cybered, yeah. What else is, I should have checked my apps. Well, my, um, well, no, I didn't look at anything before I came in here. Morning, keep going through, keep going through, keep going through. What's that? Oh, the app's working. The app is now working. The website's working, is it? No, no. Good, good thing is, I can still see you this morning and Sewing Street on Facebook. You right, Gaynor? Jean says, morning, John. Good morning, Jean. Keep going through for these four tape measures for one I've made a bit of a mess opening that. Oh, Bruce. How long did it take to open your birthday? Oh, I was there till, I was still doing it yesterday. Still doing it. Thank you for mine, by the way, Claire. Okay, Patricia, who's Rebecca? Patricia's morning, John and Rebecca. Oh, Becky Swan. Becky Swan. Here you go. Bye on Sewing Street. 0800 
4433. It's free to call. It's free to call. That's, that Hannah made that for you specially. Buy on Sewing Street. 0800 1433. Good morning, John and team, says Donna. Yeah, it's on the app. The app's working. Yeah, 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 I'll keep that there for later. Right, so I can't do a menu. So I need to read it out to you. So Hannah will have to read it out to me. Oh, no, that, no, now you see, normally when we do the menu, we put a slide up and I can move all my stuff over there. But you'll have to go with, so what is it? What are we doing? Are you ready? Because I'm going to be walking between cameras. Eight o'clock. Summer Sizzlers, eight o'clock, Summer Sizzlers. Nine o'clock, fabric bundles. Ten o'clock, Crafters Companion with Becky Swan. Uh, we're doing rulers, quilting rulers. Got the Gemini machine. Uh, Eleven o'clock, kits you will love. Twelve o'clock. Crafters Companion, 12 o'clock. Now, there's only one way you can shop, and that is on the phone. The app is working now. Completely and utterly free phone number. They're there waiting. They know there's an issue. They've got, they're ready and eager to answer your call. Uh, but it's the only way you can get in touch today. But the only way you can buy today, sorry. <coughs> All right, I'll tell you the news in a minute. Uh, I know you're working, but did you manage to have a lovely birthday? June, I did, thank you. Uh, Andy Lynn says, just painting my nails as I've got to go to a funeral. That's... Uh, what colour are you painting your nails? Oh, hang on, we've gone. What colour are you painting your nails? I don't know. Right, panels first. Frog, frog and seaside. Yep. This has only ever been on air once before. It's a panel. The other two I'm going to show you brand new. Hannah loves this. I'll hold it up for you to start with. There you go. So you've got a starfish, an urchin, a seahorse, a shell, a turtle. Don't know what that is. Uh, mermaid's tail. What's that one? Is that? I have to turn it around. Is that a conch shell there, that one? I'm not quite sure what that one is, though. It's a shell of some description. Anyway, they're beautiful, aren't they? Henry Glass. Look. I love the way some of them have got a little bit of colour, just that, because that one's got just blues, but some have got a little bit of, like, rust in them. I call that an urchin. Is that an urchin? I can watch on the app, but the early bird isn't there, and I can't message on the app. Oh, Lisa. Oh, pale pink, that'd be nice. Andy Lynn doing it a pale pink. 9 99 The only way to buy, Bruce, there you go. Buy on Sewing Street. Completely free. Morning, says Susie Duncan. Back, hang on, back put of the field. I don't know that one. What does that mean? Back put of the field and ironing loads of strip sets for Friday's Bars Yellow. Jan, the other Jan, this morning, John. Looks like it's all like being another nice set. Oh, yeah, the app looks like it's going to be gorgeous for the next three days. Gorgeous. Then the weekend, downpour. 9 99 Call up. You know the number. 0800 001 44 It's the only way to buy right now. The only way to buy. Now, panels, I've got Little Frog and Big Frog. Which one would you like to do first? Brand new, brand new, brand new. Bra Dragonfly Lagoon, this is called. So there's the one with the little squares on it. And here... It's the big one. Well, that's pretty, isn't it? But only if you like frogs and hornets, dragonflies. Oh, that dragonfly's got big eyes. 
All the better to see you with, Mr. Frog. I'm mixing my stories, obviously, now. That, I've shown both options now. <laughs> we, we tap busy typing. I, Okay, brilliant, yeah. Uh, yeah, this one, yeah. So we'll do this one first. There you go. Nine ninety nine. Remember, if you buy two, they don't come join together. It's lovely, isn't it? I'll, I'll, I'll put it on the table and we have a good look at it from the above. There we go. Look at the gorgeous colours in there. Let's start at the top. Lovely blue, marine blue frame. <coughs> Excuse me. Then you've got your dragonflies there. And your bulrushes. And then you've got your lovely big um, water... Well, they're not water lilies, are they? What would they be? I don't know what they are when they grow on a stalk like that by the water. Beautiful leaves. You've got your frogs down there. Lotus, they're lotuses, aren't they, those? Lilies. Oh, no, I, I, yeah, lilies there. There's some lilies there. It's rather gorgeous, isn't it? No ant, no app. There's no app. There's no nothing working this morning. Oh, she's back from the field after camping. That's where she is. Oh, now Lynn's got hers on the app. Hers is all right. Lynn got hers on the app. So I don't know what's going on. It's not ours. It's not an inter It's not our problem. Well, it is our problem, but it, it's not because of us. It's an outside, external issue, apparently. Okay, someone's mentioned saying the website's working. Where are you? What? Where? Whereabouts? Because we can't get it to work here. Yeah, Beverly. It's not just us. It's website, Twitter, and all sorts are all off at the moment. The only way to buy is, you're going to say this a lot because Hannah took ages to make that this morning. Buy on South Street, 0800 001 4433. The app's working now, the app is working. Oh what? Oh, check your website now, it might be working on your website. Okay, do, completely, don't, if it's on a tab, don't click on that, just sign in. Just and go to Google and search Save Street and it works that way. And Bruce has got it now as well, so's Cat. So we're all right, but the, ad, the website is now working. Here we go, try to get the early bird back. I'll do this first. 9.99. Beautiful member, it's a panel, it's brand new. If you buy two, they do not come join together. Gorgeous. Right, I'll just quickly do the early bird because you couldn't buy the early bird on the website earlier. Remember, it's a week of <coughs> bigger quad C, better prices, more exciting early birds this week. Oh, yeah, there. Oh, no, I haven't done that one yet. I haven't done that one yet. Well done to all you that did check out on the phone. Well done, call centre, for taking all the calls. The early bird is four tape measures. Now, look, this is how much it should be. A pound for each tape measure. You've got a narrow one, a medium one, and a wide one, and you've got a retractable one. Look at the price. Look at the price. Look at the price. You can check out on the web now. One pound ninety-nine for all four. You don't pick which one you want. All four are £1.99. Today's... Oh, there's... Do you know what? There's more people... Oh, it's because you can't watch on the web, isn't it? I was going to say, there's more people on website on, on Facebook than ever today. The web's now working. Thank you, Jan. Thank you, Ange. Thank you, Lynn. Thank you, Karen. Uh, Julie says, my book's brilliant. Thank you very much indeed. Well, she didn't. She would love in my book, but there you go. £1.99 for four... Four tape measures. We had a sewing group. Lots of people to measure, or you just want different things to measure, because little, medium, wide, retractable. I don't trust a retractable myself. Well, no, because over years of work are used, they're, they're pulling in and out, stretch and stretch it sometimes. But years and years, I'm talking years and years. I've got one that was a gift that was in about. 
It's just beginning to stretch now. 199 for all four. <coughs> Excuse me. One ninety nine. Somebody in an office somewhere, nothing to do with us, will have pressed the wrong button or ticked the wrong box, and that's what will have happened, isn't it? And they'll have gone home to bed. It'll be at the end of a night shoot, a night shift, and they'll have gone oh, night then, and they've gone home and realised they've switched off the whole. Uh, early bird is brilliant. Retractable one is useful in my handbag as clothing manufacturers don't have regular sizing anymore. No, Susie, that's you. Fluctuations happens at your age. Oh. It's our Susie, it's our Susie. Hello, bird out. Oh, and oh, the first one's gone. The first one's been packed. I'll do this one first, if that's right, while we get it. Oh, thank you. And the big one as well, even though we did it on the web. Okay. Brand new today, Henry Glass. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight gorgeous squares. Remember, it's a panel. If you buy more than one, they do not come joined together. Nine ninety nine. Nine ninety nine. You're so rude, Mr. Scott, she says. Yeah, but the truth hurts, Susie. I know, I fluctuate. Oh, do I fluctuate. Three, nine ninety nine. I don't know if I said three then. Nine ninety nine. Henry Glass, beautiful cotton. Brand new today. At nine pounds and ninety nine pence. Now what's that? You can shop on the web now, so Hannah's slide is no longer needed. Well that keep it on one side in case it goes again. Yeah. What's that there, do you reckon? What sort? Is it meant to be a peony, do you think? Because that's a peony bud, isn't it? Don't you? I don't know. I don't know. Beautiful tulips. Um, anemones. Uh, I and iris lilies. All different lilies. More tulips. Irises. Frog. Dahlia. Lotus, I'd say. Beautiful. Right, that was that one for £9.99. I'll do the other dark blue one next, which you just saw very briefly, which is the big frog and the big dragonfly lagoon. Brand new today. I'll put it straight down the floor, actually. There you go. Well, the gorgeous. Remember, it's a panel. They do not come joined together if you buy more than one. <coughs> Make a lovely centre of a quilt, wouldn't it? Or a wall hanging. Beautiful. Gorgeous. $9.99, hundred percent cotton, Henry Glass. Brand new today. Fabulous. Now, I did a panel right at the beginning, but a lot of you might not have been able to come in and get this one. This has only ever been on air once before, so it's new. It's brand new to me. So that's half of it. So you've got your seashell, your seahorse, your shell, and your turtle. Looks like there you go. And then on this, it's not on this side, it's the other half of the fabric. Your urchin, your starfish, your mermaid, and your... Lo I've got one, a big one of those in my bathroom that my friend Mary Richards bought me. Beautiful, nine ninety nine. <coughs> Excuse me. I think the aircon's getting to me a bit. I've I've got my own ginger water. Thank you very much for taking my inhaler and everything. Right now, before I go any further and show you any fabric, back in stock. Now I'm not doing a demo, but there will be a demo tomorrow. On sewing machine and embroidery machine from brother, they're back in. What have you put in first? Embroidery machine first. The first time it was on, it sold out. They're just back in stock now. Stuart's going to be doing a demo on them tomorrow, but I just thought I'd give you the heads up today. 
And, and a lot of people missed out last time. People have been talking about it on the website, going, oh, I missed out, I missed out, I missed out. It's back in now, and we've got good stock. We've got very good stock. Look at the price, £599, split pay. Three split pays of 199.66, And it comes with all sorts. It comes with Disney things and everything on it. Got a USB so you can load other, other designs. Uh, the, it has a four inch hoop, doesn't it, on that one? A four inch hoop on that one. 45 Disney designs. Three year warranty. Good value for money, high quality. We haven't had an embroidery machine ever since I've worked here. And it was shown once and completely and utterly sold out. Sold out. Tracy came in with Stuart and they did a, a, a demo. Completely and utterly sold out. Back in stock now, for those of you who missed it. I wouldn't wait. If you're thinking, oh, well, I'll wait till tomorrow when Stuart... I wouldn't wait. Even though we've got an enormous amount of stock, I wouldn't wait. I put it in my basket. I buy, I buy it today. Obviously, you won't have it in time for tomorrow. Then you can sit back and watch Stuart's demo tomorrow. In you know, see they're going out. They're going already. They're going already. Look, there's a slide there. Disney. Now, whatever you do, do not sell. Do not try and sell the things you make with the Disney logos on. You can gift them, but you cannot sell them. All the other preloaded designs you can, you can make to sell. It's just the Disney ones that you can't sell. So gift them, and then they might give you a present of five pounds later. But you know what I mean? Don't sell them, do not sell them. Be aware, if you've been waiting for that to come back in stock, I think they're gonna go. I think they're gonna go. So I'll keep reminding you during the day, but I do think they're gonna go today. And also, if you don't want the, the embroidery machine, the sewing machine is back as well. The sewing machine is back. The price of the sewing machine is incredible. 250 stitches, three alphabet styles, all in uppercase, three year warranty, and great split pay. Watch when it comes down, 133, 133. Gorgeous little machine. In fact, Emma, Emma Bradford used it the other day for the first time. Beautiful, 250 stitches, three alphabets, plus everything else. <coughs> Christine on the bottom, it's working. Absolutely love my embroidery machine, so it's used from Christine. Thank you, Christine, my love, for letting me know. Oh, wait, hang on. Margaret, it's summer solstice, longest day of the year. All strange tip, and they do. Oh, especially down there in Devon. I'm going to win that lovely O'May's house. Oh, no, I'm not, because I haven't bought any tickets for it yet. Have you seen the new O'May's house? It's for blood. They're brilliant, because the money go, a lot of money goes to charity. So it's, so it's a, Cor a, a Cornwall one, but the first Cornwall one's already gone. And it's a new Cornwall one. This is an eco-friendly one that's built like that. And the estuary, it looks out on the estuary, it's gorgeous. It looks a bit small for three million pounds. For my, my, yeah. Yeah, a bit small. It does come fully furnished. I'd make do and mend. Well, would you? Would you, would you live in it? Would you rent it out? Would you buy, sell it? What would you do? I want all my friends to come and stay. Big party, then sell it. You can then get the cleaners in, then sell it. That's gorgeous, three ninety nine. I'll tell you later. I'll tell you about it again later. Right. No, not the house, the sewing machine. Right, next. Oh, I've got velvets, I've got beer, I've got butterflies, I've got flowers. All the summery things you could think of. Velvets next, these are stunning. In fact, you know, Kate uh, made me a cushion, a pieced cushion on the back, had some of this velvet, this beautiful, on the back. How outrageous that the back of the cushion was velvet. Yellow, I presume you mean this one. Oh, this is lovely. Now, Rebecca Reed launched this. You can make cushions, you can make skirts, you can make whatever you want out of it. It's a beautiful digitally printed velvet. 
100% polyester, it's $8.99 for half a meter. Yeah, very short pile, very, very short pile. Oh, okay, the details don't say anywhere that it's a velvet fabric. It's not a printed cotton, it's, wait till you feel it. It's, it feels so beautiful. I don't know if Kate will be watching yet, but she can tell us how it was to sew with. I imagine it's really easy to sew with. This one is now very limited already at Hopper State in the morning. Kinabalu, Kinabalu, tropical summer fabric. They're what? Oh, I thought said, I was going to say, I can't see any faces. I thought Hannah said they've all got faces on them. A mountain in Malaysia. Plenty of room for more ducks in the Amaze house, says Tilly. Oh, yeah, Tilly, you'd love it. Shelley says, Good morning. Sat watching you and reading your book. Aww. $8.99. Oh, it looks beautiful, apparently, the mountain. Is that, is that a cheese tree? Oh, is that a piece of cheese in the tree there? Is that how you grow cheese? Eight ninety nine. Hannah's lost it. It's uh, it feels. I wish we had um, feely telly because you'd absolutely love this. Lovely. Two meters left. That's all of that one. Right. We're moving on to the next one. I've got two of those. With what? Yep. Oh, this one's cute as a button, isn't it? Look. Monkey, parrot, cheetah, pelican, crane. Have I missed anything out? No, that's it. A flamingo. Monte Verde, that's Green Mountain. In Costa Rica. You, you should have gone back in the day. Eight ninety nine. Costa Rica, it's lovely. Yeah, my friend Barbie, she's went twice. She went one years ago and then just recently. She just, maybe it's just that her memories of it are different, you know. We often hold romantic memories of places, don't we? <clears throat> Apparently there's a word where you look back on something in, with, through rose-tinted spectacles. Beautiful, $8.99. <clears throat> Wonder what the council tax would be on that Omaze house. Well, I don't know. I love these velvets. Here you go, collect. This is Kate, I told you. Uh, so smooth and gorgeous and so. No shedding and doesn't fray. Absolutely fabulous. One direction is smoother than the other. Well, one direction, never very smooth in my eye. Yes, that's the nap. But it's not a big nap like you'd normally expect on a velvet. But obviously you're not going to get the direction wrong with this because you've got a directional fabric, haven't you? So you know you're going to have your pieces going in the right direction. Look how wide it is. Make two, three cushion, uh, no, hang on, let's have a look. So two cushion fronts would be, oh no, they're too big. Yeah, or makeup bag, oh. Yeah, but is it washable? Oh, I understand, but yeah, but velvet, you, you sometimes have to be a bit careful washing velvet, don't you? Yeah, I try clean it. Well, no, should we see, if those, have we got, um, no, we won't have, we won't. I think you could make comfortably three gorgeous cushion fronts out of that. Look, there you go. That would be the size. If you did three, that's how big they'd be like that. It is beautiful. I mean, it's polyester, so you should be able to wash it. But I'm just worried sometimes if you wash velvet, the pile goes a little bit weird, doesn't it? Cool wash, no tumbling. Yeah, cool wash is fine. Beautiful, isn't it? 
Right, okay, that's that one. Now, the other black one, did you say? Oh. This is lovely. Isn't it? It's very um, tropical, mysterious. Have I got it the right way up? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah. The other way? Let's have a look at the other way. Oh, yeah, no, definitely got the right way up. <coughs> those leaves. You can almost see the dew glistening on those leaves, can't you? It's like the gorgeous, not undergrowth, don't say undergrowth, but it's like the, the belly of the forest, isn't it? <coughs> Excuse me, I need to cough today since I come into the air comp. Lovely. Oh, I don't know what any of those plants are, I'm afraid. Oh, it's now a... Oh, no. I think I've had one of these before. They're kind of strange, aren't they? Aren't they called something tongue? Oh, less than five metres, this one. Hang on, what was that called? Tasmania? Yep, Tasmania. OK, next one. Yep. Oh, oh, look, that's like the birdhouse at the zoo, isn't it, that one? So you've got a toucan, a parrot, same parrot as before, a uh, peacock. Oh, look, that one's got a big bug. Is that a bug there? Is that a bug? Hang on, let me put it up. That there, it's got legs. Oh. That's a leaf. That there. Oh, I thought it was a bug growing up the... Sumatra. There it is again, you see, yeah? You think that's a flower, Jim? Like a pineapple? Yeah. I, I can see it moving. <laughs> That's Bird of Paradise. No, is that called Bird of Paradise, that plant there? The orange, and they come out orange. Beautiful, aren't they? 100% polyester velvet. I love the fact that it's just colours where you don't imagine, you know, you don't expect to see colours. Like, the detailing on it is lovely. Beautiful. One more, and then that's it. That's my velvet's done, then. Oh, this is a lovely colour, this one. It's ever so wide as well, this ribbon. It's what? Borneo duck egg. Um, now look, that lily is rainbow lily there. Vix bought me some rainbow socks for my birthday and a notepad with sachet away. I should that because I bought Maisie a t-shirt with sachet away written on her t-shirt, yeah. Um, oh yeah, Hannah, you're so right, there it is. Oh, you've seen these before. Oh, that could be it then. There's me thinking it was an animal because this one's not got any lit legs, that's why. That one's a little bit weird, isn't it, that one there? It's what? <laughs> it's not a hot dog, Bruce. Because they'll they be blackberries, wouldn't they, then? I presume you'd, I would I'd tell you not to eat anything on that page, though. Yes. Yes. It's gorgeous. It's one of those fabrics you look at, and every time you look at it, you see something a bit different. Uh, 8 99 half a metre. Very popular, these are. That's the end of the velvets. Just like th a two bundle of two. And we've, now we've got, we've got this, right? Of this collection. Now the only two that are left of the collection. It is Sassy Summer Salsa. Blimey. Sassy Summer Salsa by Jane Sassaman. I've never seen it, so it's the end of the fabric and I've never seen it.
gorgeous. Well, obviously it was really popular if I've not seen it. This is a bundle. Oh, we're crashing. Last of. I have got these two fabrics by the half meter, but I can't imagine it's very much of it. Oh, I haven't. I haven't. It's gone. Okay. Uh, 9 .99 for But you get both those. You get both those. A meter of designer fabric for 9 99 yeah, we won't be getting this collection again, but we get some more of hers, and I get to see it because I didn't see this one. Oh, I love that one, the Gerberas. Half a metre of that, and half a metre. Okay, half the, half the stock of the bundles has gone straight into baskets. Gorgeous, 9 99 Six, six left. Six bundles left, and that's it. It's love, you see, it's an unusual colour that that background colour, isn't it? Not gorgeous. What were the others like then? Oh, nine ninety nine. Sassy Summer Seltzer by Jane Sassaman. Gorgeous free spirit fabrics. Okay, three left, three of those left. Well done, congratulations, you got that. Yep, yeah, I've got a green one and a purple one. Okay, which one would I do first? Green first. Gorgeous. I haven't got all of them, oh, you have. If you want those by the half metre, they're available underneath on uh, uh, what there's left. 2097, this is. So you got half metre of the big bugs. No, no, uh, hang on, they're not all bugs, are they? Half metre of the sunshine, tortoise, and butterflies. Half metre of the little happy bugs, and half metre of the baby flowers. Look at the colour. Oh, hang on, I thought you said you couldn't crash those. Okay. Seventeen ninety nine for a metre and a half of fabric. Dan Morris, new collection. Well, it wasn't. It's going to be sold out now. Look. There are your three fabrics. Make sure you go through. Make sure you go through. Right, there's 15 of these bundles left. I've also got it. Oh yeah, I've got the same bundle in pink and purple coming up next. 17.99 that is. They're cute, aren't they? I love all the, that kind of um, psychedelia. I think it's called that one, isn't it? Beautiful. Seventeen ninety nine. Moving on. Look at the time already. I suppose we had all that issues at the beginning. That's why it's just gone quickly. Then we've got exactly the same fabrics, being pinks and purples. Twenty one. Oh, is it twenty ninety seven? No. Seventeen ninety nine. This is going to. Uh, remember, if you already checked out, which quite a few of you have, you pay the final low price, which this is, $17.99. <clears throat> Sunbright by Dan Morris. I've got some more Dan Morris fabrics coming up, haven't I, in this hour? Yes, John, you have. <laughs> yes. Gorgeous, aren't they? They're uplifting. Stunning. In fact, I like, I like. I love that green. I la 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 la. I love the green, but I think I like the pink best in this one. Well, I've got a panel to go with this. Yeah. Okay, that's a bundle. Right. So I've got three fabrics that weren't in the bundles. These three. Now, so this is not a bundle. I'm, hang on, wait for that. Okay. 
This is not a bundle. These are individual, these three. From the same range. Oh, and the panel as well, obviously. Right, first. Stripes. Now, I remember when we did this the first time, and I said this looked like a burger. Well, look, it looks like the two bread, the burger, and the sauce and everything. Six ninety nine for half a meter. No, no one agrees with me. It's lovely. I love them. Making my eyes go a bit funny. Six pound ninety nine for half a meter. I'm sent cotton machine washable quilting weight, forty four inches wide, by Dan Morris. Lovely, isn't it? What will you make with it? What would you do with that? Mix in with some solids. Do some half square triangles, maybe. Pinwheels. Beautiful. Next. Stripey one. Now remember, I'll hold this up so you can see the way the stripes go. There you go. So would you cut it up? Would you use it as a striped fabric? Little children's dungarees would be nice in that, wouldn't they? Gorgeous. 6 99 for half a metre. Now you're buying it off the bolt now. It's not in a bundle. So you can have as much, as little as you want, as long as it's in increments of half a metre. Lovely, isn't it? Uplifting. Then the last fabric of this range is the orange one. With all the little bugs and the... There must be frogs on there somewhere. Oh, no. Mushrooms, caterpillars. Oh, there's no frog on there. Butterflies. Some bright tossed butterflies, this one's called. The background is so vibrant. That would look gorgeous with the green background that we had earlier. Lovely. Keep going through, keep going through, keep going through. Then we've got the panel. It's enormous, this. Look. Blimey. Never ending, right? Now this is massive. Is this? Are you sure it's a panel? Car, twelve ninety nine. Look at it; it's massive. You could do that um, game like a snap game. Make snap ones out of that, couldn't you? Couldn't you? But don't machine stitch them, because Wendy says children memorise the stitching and they'll know. Very clever at children these days. Why right, wrong way up. Look at the colours on there. What else would you do with it apart from making snap cards? Oh, it'd be a lovely back of a quilt, yeah. Frog. Tortoise. Bumblebee. Caterpillar. Sunshine. Oh, no, that's a bumblebee. Yeah, what, were you looking, what was that there then? What's that one? That wasp. With big wings. Imagine if one flew like that. I thought you'd, you'd know about it, wouldn't you? Gorgeous. Next. Dan Morris, Ambiance Design Roll. That's this one. The colours in this are just stunning. Now, Stuart's made a strippy doodah bag as this, isn't he? 49.99. <clears throat> Lovely, isn't it? It does annoy me when they don't even write on the label that it was a Dan Morris. No, here it is open. Thank you, Kat. Colours and the patterns in here are, look at that, just exquisite, aren't they? Look, 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 look. 
It's got a feeling of cave, that one, isn't it? Very Missoni esque they are. Look. Then you've got your swirls. Oh, look, it's lovely stripes. These are all two and a half inches wide, 44 inches long. Vibrant, beautiful, pure colours, $49.99. La oh look at that, it's got nice big flowers in that one. What's the man what's my hand? Oh low in stock now. Poor old Hannah's suffering with her hay fever today. Oh look at that. Do what what? Oh that's nice. She's looking forward to blowing her nose in the break, she says. More nasal spray. Beautiful look. Oh, now, more people got that in their basket than we've got available. Well done. Make sure you check out. True blue sea fabric. Only in a bundle, this one. I've not seen this one either. Been on once before with Vix, that's it. Oh, and you save you six pounds? Yeah, she said, yeah. Right, what are those called? Kites, skates, stingrays, and... Now those are the things you see on the beach, aren't they? Mermaid purses, apparently. What's inside? Seeds? Or eggs? Oh, anyway. That one. And there you go. You, oh, look at him. He's a bit saucy. Seagull eating chips. Then you've got your stripes. Starfish, anchors, fish, seahorses with knots, and boats. Forty-nine ninety-two. You get four meters of fabric. Hang on. One, two, three, four. Oh, yes, yeah, me. I can't count. One. Yeah, definitely. Eight. Beautiful, nautical but nice, as Hannah would say. Yup, she says, yup. 49.92 with six pounds saving. Oh no, oh no, oh no, oh no. Lovely, isn't it? Which is your favorite? Forty-nine ninety-two. What day of the week is it? Oh, it's Tuesday. Tuesday. I thought John was on holiday. No, not yet. I've got two tu Tuesday, Wednesday and Thursday. Then I've got on holidays. Okay, moving on. Pineapple fabric and banana fabric. Oh, she's put it right at the end there. Right, which one first? Pineapples. Again, Dan Morris. Uh, six ninety nine and a half metre. Not today. But please be careful. Last of stock. This is last of stock. Four forty nine. I got the stingray fabric to a cushion. Bought a meter as I love it. So a ready made cushion, simply designed, forty five pounds. Oh my word. I often think that when you do go into the department stores and you see fat you always sell that fabric and then you see how much the cushion's made out of they someone's made a cushion out of it and how much they can charge. Four forty nine as well. Should be six ninety nine a half meter. When you mix in your cocktails, Hannah says. Oh, has that got pineapple in it? Pina colada. Oh, yeah, you had a, had a pineapple quilt yesterday. I think Rebecca Reader tried to nick one of them because it was under the desk. It's all right, I've got it now. She's going off in her, um, in her crocheted trousers today to Glastonbury, isn't she? Mandy Shaw's already at Glastonbury. 
or 49? Hayley, Hayley, uh, it's, it, to watch our YouTube feed, you have to go to the Yarn Lane uh, YouTube, you'll see it there. Brilliant, moving on. Banana, a banana, or a banana. Bright, isn't it? Six ninety nine. It's the only one I've got. It's the only one I've got left of the fruit now. Going to four forty nine. Well, I was going to say, haven't I got a fabric hour later, so I can always put it in there. Four forty nine. Yep. Beautiful. Right, now remember, back in stock. Now, the embroidery machine is flying out. I told you it would, didn't I? Uh, the first time it was on air with Tracy and Stuart, sold out completely. We've now got it back in stock, back in stock, back in stock. £599. Wait to see the split pay. Oh, wait. Uh, four inch, there it is. 199.66, three times. That's all you have to pay. Uh, lots and lots and lots of you can wait for it to come back in. 45 preloaded Disney designs, which you cannot sell, but the other preloaded designs you can sell. That's not an issue. Oh, and you're not limited because you've got a USB stick to put your own in. Uh, brother, do lots of free ones. Uh, it's incredible. Uh, you can either watch the demo when it was launched, or you can wait till tomorrow because Stuart's going to be doing a demo on it tomorrow. But I wouldn't wait, I wouldn't wait till tomorrow to buy it. Get ahead, that's what I would do. Obviously you won't have received it by the time, but what you can do is buy it today. Know that yours is on its way, it's got a three year warranty by the way. Now these come from us, they don't come from brother, they come direct from us, there it is. Um, buy it today, know that yours is on its way, and then watch Stuart's demo tomorrow. He's doing that and the, and the same machine tomorrow. £519, split pay. Well, it's £200, isn't it? Three, over three months. Each over three, yeah, over three months. Also, the same machine is back in stock. 399 the same machine, look. Split pay, 133. Three alphabets that machine has got. 250 stitches that machine has got. Uh, three year warranty that has got. And split pay if you'd like it with absolutely no interest whatsoever and we send it out as soon as you paid your first split pay do you know what I mean it's not like we wait for you to pay the whole lot so if you pay if you do choose to take split pay take split pay pay it today it'll be sent to you in the next couple of days uh, and then you just pay the other two 133s after that I know it's brilliant isn't it no interest charge whatsoever Right, sadly, CL can't be with us uh, today. She's not very well. So we've got other shows to show you now. After the break, I've got Fabric Bundles. Uh, we'll see you in four from now. Have you heard about Yarn Lane, a TV show dedicated to knitting, crochet and all things yarn, bringing you demonstrations from our expert guests as well as the latest tools? and find out what's coming up on the show by following us on Facebook and Instagram. Subscribe to our email newsletter or visit the programme guide on our website at www.yarnlane.com. Sewing Street have our very own app. You can now watch and shop from anywhere. Simply download the app from your app store onto your smartphone or tablet, then log in or create an account and you're done. You can watch us live from anywhere, browse all our recently played items and pre-orders so you never miss out on any show deals and message the studio to say hello at any time. And remember, you can check out as many times as you want and only pay one P&P all day.
Follow Sewing Street and Yarn Lane on Facebook and Instagram to keep up to date with what's coming up on the show, as well as being the first to know about our amazing offers. Get involved with our competitions that are exclusive to social media. And pick up some top tips from us too. Stuck for ideas for the perfect gift? Why not get them a gift card? You can buy Sewing Street and Yarn Lane gift cards loaded up with anything from £10 to £500. Shop our gift cards online at www.sewingstreet.com or www.yarnlane.com or purchase them via our UK call centre on 0800 001 4433. We know that shopping online can be a confusing and sometimes daunting task. And sometimes all you want to do is talk to a human being. Our family-run customer service team are on call 24-7. Full of friendly, warm-hearted individuals, all trained to make your shopping experience as easy and enjoyable as possible. Not only will they take your order, they'll also help and guide you on your shopping journey, so you never miss out. Missed the live show? Don't worry, we recorded it for you. Never miss out on your favourite presenters, guests and makes ever again. Head on over to our YouTube pages to watch back the day's live show and enjoy your favourite demos over and over again. We also have lots of great content exclusive to our YouTube pages, such as product demonstrations, troubleshooting videos and so much more. Subscribe and turn on the bell notification so you never miss a show or video ever again. Have you heard about all of the different ways you can shop with Sewing Street and Yarn Lane? You can either shop on our websites, sewingstreet.com and yarnlane.com. You can also order by phone by calling our friendly UK customer service team. For Sewing Street, call 0800 001 4433. And for Yarn Lane, call 0800 4700 600. And don't forget about the Sewing Street app. Here you can shop all of the Sewing Street products as well as watch the live shows from anywhere. You can download the app onto your smartphone or your tablet by simply searching Sewing Street in your app store. And one final thing, no matter how many times you check out on Sewing Street or Yarn Lane in one day, you will only pay one postage and packaging. Happy shopping! If you're a Sewing Street or Yarn Lane customer, no matter how many times you check out in one day, you will only pay one postage and packaging. So don't wait to add the item you want to your basket and check out. You will only pay one PMP even if you check out multiple times in one day. Are you a fan of Sewing Street and Yarn Lane? Why not join our growing Facebook fans pages? Just search Sewing Street Fans and Yarn Lane TV Fans on Facebook and click Join Group. It's that simple. Never miss out on the latest news and updates from our presenters and guest designers, special offers and plenty of chat with your fellow fans. Share photos of your makes, ask for advice, interact with your favourite guests and presenters and be a part of the ever-growing sewing and yarn community. See you there. Have you heard about Yarn Lane, a TV show dedicated to knitting, crochet and all things yarn, bringing you demonstrations from our expert guests as well as the latest tools? and find out what's coming up on the show by following us on Facebook and Instagram. Subscribe to our email newsletter or visit the programme guide on our website at www.yarnlane.com. Follow Sewing Street and Yarn Lane on Facebook and Instagram to keep up to date with what's coming up on the show, as well as being the first to know about our amazing offers. Get involved with our competitions that are exclusive to social media. And pick up some top tips from us too.
Keep up to date with what's on Sewing Street and Yarn Lane, as well as all the latest news and special offers by signing up to our email newsletters. For Sewing Street, head on over to www.sewingstreet.com, scroll down to the bottom of the homepage, type in your email address, click the envelope, and you're done. It's exactly the same for Yarn Lane. Head on over to www.yarnlane.com, scroll down to the bottom of the homepage, type in your email address, click the envelope, and that's it. You are now subscribed to both Sewing Streets and Yarn Lane's email newsletters. Never miss out on the latest news and special offers ever again. Now, I've got two requests this hour. One is for some X-ray backing. I'll do it for you in that for you in a minute, Hayley. But this... Uh, now, um, this has been requested, but they want a full demo. They want a full... I'm quite happy. So in this, fa in this fabric hour, I'm going to be demoing... Well, I'm going to do it now. This belt, I love it, I love it, I love it, right? It's a, which is by Beldre, which you know is a really good make, because we do all our irons from Beldre, and they sell out like that, don't they? For thirty-four ninety-nine. Now, I know what you're thinking. Oh, these, they, these things, they're, they're, they're just a gimmick. They don't work at all. These are brilliant, right? So this is how yours will arrive in a lovely box like that. And then when you open the box, you have this, right? Now, this is the charger unit. This can either just sit on the table or you can screw it to a wall. Uh, now, you know Hannah said she was going to blow her nose in the break. Oh no, that's it, if you open, it's like when you do your nasal spray, it sets it off. Anyway, or you can screw this to the wall. In your, so if you're in your shed, which is like a shed wall, like this, isn't it? Screw it to the wall like that. And what happens is this just sits on there like that. So you can, it's a storage, but you can also recharge it. So you can recharge it while it's on the wall there and everything. Now it's fantastic because it's a wet and dry vacuum cleaner now with sneezing now not just not just blowing noses but listen so you charge it up the little charger is there mine's already charged up the little charger units in there okay and then to work it you literally oh dear hannah's on the right on the right one so you literally just switch on there the green light goes on i can hear it can't you it's a really 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 good suction so that's fine so here are my gluten-free biscuits. I'm just going to do a bit of this. There you go. Those biscuits, I better put that away now. Those biscuits all over the table. So, are you, oh no, I need to also tell you, comes with two nozzles, right? It comes with this one here. For doing dry you can use it without that if you want to but that one just slips into the end there that's your dry nozzle and then this one here is your wet nozzle right so let's just put the dry one on switch on the um, vacuum look how brilliant that is if you need it to do the stairs if you've got a caravan that you go to a holiday home that you go to your sewing room when you've got all your bits and bobs and your threads and everything all out there. Look at that. And then all of it goes into here. Now the way that you empty that is you literally press the release button there and that will open. Now none of it's made its way into the actual um, gubbins of the machine here. You can literally pull out, you've got a filter. Oh, there you go. You've got a filter and there's all your rubbish in there. So we'll just get rid of that into the bin. There we go. Put that in the bin. Right, now. Pop that back in there. That goes back in there. Come on, John. One job. To what? To matter? Oh, yeah, you can use it for 20 minutes after you charge it up, yeah. Perfect for the stairs, because you can't carry your, your big... Oh, blimey, John. Very, very... Um, What's the word? Durable. Very durable. No, I didn't put it down. I was too, too busy thinking of Hannah on her staircase. That's what I was doing. Oh! What is the matter? <laughs> if the antihistamines are getting to me. And now that I'm on my super powerful ones. Right, that goes in there. That goes in there. Click. Click. Right, now, let's do some water. 
They always go mad when I... I hope it's together now. Oh, let's put the right nozzle on. Hannah always spills tea. I'm thinking more of red wine, Hannah, for you. Right, okay. Spill some water. Right, there we go. You ready? Did you see? Did you see it's gone? Doesn't break your Beldre vacuum cleaner at all. But what you must do is obviously tip that out. Don't just put it back in the box and put it on the shelf while it's still wet. But um, obviously you're not going to be able to do gallons of it, but it's just a glass of wine or children's juice, something like that, you just spilled it. Get it up really, really quickly. What I would suggest is that you empty the water out straight away because if you then start doing dust on it again, the water and the dust will all coagulate and everything like that. But how brilliant was that? How strong was that? 34.99. There you go. I'll just move this over here. Out of the way. There's the other nozzle. Thank you, cat. Right, I'm back. Now the other one, the other request. X-ray backing. X-ray backing. Well done, you got your little vac lots he came in then. I might recon. Oh, so, yeah, if you're doing soft... Now, no, if you're doing soft toy making, the line doesn't make much fluff at all. No, but the others, if you're doing the others, they do. Extra wide backing, 108 inches wide. Back in stock. I was going to say, I thought this one had sold out. It's love, isn't it? Oh, last year it was. Last year. Go back six months later, we get it back. It's the... Malka Malka. Now they called it red. I wouldn't call it red, but I'd call it more of a rust terracotta. X wide backing, 274 centimetres. You're getting it by the half. Look at the price. Look at the price. These are normally <coughs> these are normally 13.99, aren't they? They say that again. I know this is the made-up price. Anna did well over two years ago now. Uh, morning, John. I just live up the road from the festival. The piece is over until next week. Oh, Maria. Think of the music you can listen to, though. I think one of those people queuing up outside your house is Rebecca Reed in her crochet trousers. I know. Eight ninety nine. I wonder if she goes with her girlfriends or whether she goes with the family. Oh, yeah. Eight ninety nine. Beautiful, isn't it? Gorgeous pattern, lovely colours, and it's extra wide. And it's only eight ninety nine home percent cotton, hundred and eight inches wide. Lovely. Uh, so I the request he come in. Not yet, not yet. Maybe she didn't know we were doing it now. Oh, no, 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 because I can do it from it. Oh, yes, 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 do, 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 do. Yeah. <laughs> so Hannah just asked me a question, and I was like, no, 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 no. Yes, 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 please do. Just tell him he always has to. 8 99 That's my producer for tomorrow, prepping already. No, next door, it's Mike and uh, Roscoe next door. Gorgeous, 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 gorgeous. Do you know, oh, go on, go on. No, who's that from? And there's good reason for that, Marion. Here we go. Oh, load it right. I'll keep that to one side. No request. Been out of stock since last year. Oh, uh, well. How did the request see no we got it back in? I'll try and talk. I'll try and talk properly. How did the request see know that we even had it? Anyway, they haven't come in yet. Which is fine. It's totally fine. But loads of people are. Please be careful. 8 99 Do you know what, you see? This is why it's brilliant here, right? So we haven't had this in since last year. 
They could so, management could so easily have gone, oh, do you know what? We can put up at 11.99 now. It's been a year. But we haven't. They put it back in. That's nothing to do with us. That's nothing to do with me. I can't take credit for that. But um, 8.99. 8.99, I know. Brilliant. I'm going to keep that there in case Rest Questy wants to see it again later. Next. Bundles. Now everything I've got in this hour is a bundle. Can we start? At the very beginning. This one. No. <laughs> this one. Yeah. Right. Here we go. Henry Glass, Misty Morning, grey fabric, six metres. Oh, now lots of these fabrics are now sold out by the half metre. So we can't, we cannot remake this. Did I? Beautiful. Oh, yeah, this on the 12th of July, uh, 12th of June. Right, so there's that one there, which is leaf and paisley. Grey on black. Leaf and paisley, grey on white. Oh, lovely. Summer meadow at night time. Roses, grey on black. Parsley. No, I don't know why I've called that parsley. Sprig on yellow. Then, we've suddenly got a geometric. Um, what's it's of the moon? What do I call it? Phases of the moon. Or cheese. Roses in grey on white with yellow highlight. Sprigs on grey. Oh, that's not, shouldn't be in there. H hang on, Sam. Oh, well, we'll count a minute. Sprigs in yellow. Then we have the lovely stripes. Then we have the lovely roses. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven. Right, there should be another fabric then. Hang on, let's have a look at the still. Right, okay, let's have a look. Can you put that on the big telly for me, please? Oh, no, that's not... <laughs> right, hang on. So that's that one. Then I've got grey roses on grey. Oh, it's that second one along at the top that's missing, is it? Oh, no, that's that one. Oh, I know which one's missing. Yellow stripes missing. Right, hang on. Where's the cave bundle? No. Hang on. No. No. OK, so let me just explain. That one there... That one there has been sent up by accident. What you get is you get half a meter of this, but in the yellow as well. That's the one that's missing. Gorgeous, though, aren't they? I wonder how that happened. Yeah, maybe, because I definitely haven't got it here. Right, I'll give that. The what? The hay fever has got into their eyes, apparently. 83, 90, no, 88, sorry, 83, 88. Let's have a quick look at them again. Beautiful. Yellow roses on black. Half, now remember, this is a bundle, so you get half a metre of each. Now, some of these have sold out on their own, so the only way you can get them is in the bundle. <coughs> grey roses on black. You get the grey stripe, you also get that in yellow. Then you get the vine, yellow vine. Sprig, rose, moons, sprig. Gorgeous meadow at night time. Paisley and leaf on grey, uh, on cream, on white. Paisley and leaf on black. £83 pounds and 88 pence. Beautiful. 44 inches wide, machine washable, quilting weight. Henry glass, good quality. Of late, 8388. Gorgeous. Next. Cave bundles. I've got a blue one and a red and orange. Oh, that's the yeah, orange and purple one. Purple, a blue one. Oh, that's. Is that that fabric? 
Yeah, no, no, no. What I'm thinking is that's the same fabric that was in the in that one by error. So maybe they just cut them out by accident. But anyway, half a meter. Yeah, half. Half a meter, half a meter, half a meter, half a meter. It's beautiful. Look at that. 1999, you get two caves and two rows and hubbles. Sheila, I'm not going on holiday till Friday. I'm going, Sheila. Sheila. That's right. I'm going on Friday, uh, but I'm not getting overexcited because so many flights have been delayed. So I'm just keeping my fingers crossed. Anyway, 1999. Beautiful. Green, blue, uh, swirls or shells and flowers. Look at that. This one's called Charlotte. It's beautiful, isn't it? Usa, thank you for getting us our opener for the weekend. Where have you been? Where were you off? Where did you go? I got an out of office thing. This is good. I'm talking to gorgeous Chloe, who's our, I, d I don't know what her title is, but she runs the building. Oh, she went to a spa for the day. 19.99, half a metre of each. Beautiful, isn't it? Lovely. Now I've got the purple and pink one. No, this is not pink, John. This is orange. Purple and orange one. I love this one. Look at these. They're like brightly coloured succulents, aren't they, those? I think it's called... Oh, no, shadow flower it's called. It looks like those succulents, doesn't it? Yeah. And then... Oh, I've got the most lovely terrarium. For my birthday, for my friend, um, well, from, you know, from Jane Alcock, right? It's when you build yourself, so it arrived, and then you got the thing, and then you have to put the plants in yourself and everything like that. And it's got beads in it, like muddy beads in it. Anyway, uh, what's this one called? Regal Fans. No, you see, I always thought these like Emily Moore mast, and that was the uh, radio waves coming out from the mast. It's not, though. Let's hope you do get away. You've worked so hard. Oh, if I don't, if I don't get away. I will. I'm thinking positively. Thinking positively. Anyway, you get that one, that one, that one, and that one for your 19.99. I love that one. Have we got, have we by any chance got that by the half metre? I'm, no, no, I'm talking about for them, I'm talking about for me. <laughs> And it's gone. Yeah, if you search CAFE on the website, you'll find. I'll do that when I finish then, shall I? Thank you. I'll move on. Right, now it doesn't matter. Doesn't matter. Where's next then? Uh, and she sounded like um, the. Oh, uh, uh, up. Do you remember that program I loved? Mama Bebe, right? She sounded like Mama Bebe then. I just get this bundle of joy. So many bundles of joy, John. Which? Oh, you just said what? Yeah, it was on my birthday. Oh, there it is. There. There's a bundle of joy. Is this bright? You never watched it, so you don't know that that's what you said, Shannon. Right? So this is the bright one now. I have a feeling that the um, other one, bright and, would it have been dark? It wouldn't have been dull, would it? They wouldn't have called it, <laughs> it's my, no, no, it was a new one I had on my birthday, but anyway, I think that one's gone. How many of these have I got? Oh, I've got this one open, actually. I've got this one open. 44.99. Look, you got the cave in the pink. The mosaic and uh, no maze that one's called is it maze 
Then you've got those beautiful flowers in the pink and purple. Then you've got that lovely one on fishnet. Then you've got that one. Hey, I definitely, well, I opened, that means a, a studio sample has gone back to the studio, uh, back to the warehouse. 44.99. Okay, facet bright. I'm going to have to open this one then. Do it very gently. There we go. What I'll do is I'll just pull it like that and like, there we go. So we can have a look at them. They're beautiful, aren't they? Orange in pink and blue. You got the rusty ones. You got your fishes on uh, Missoni's. Look at that one. That's like a, a stained glass window, isn't it? Stunning. Forty-four ninety-nine. This is. You get forty-two ten-inch squares. Look, there's that one geranium leaves. They, they, they're just it's Philip Jacobs's birthday on the same day as mine as well there's your oranges <gasps> look at big sunflowers in there that's your folk art one there look at the colours are just amazing the I bet they have such fun on their days when they do colouring in there's the same as the one on the front with the black background chrysanthemums Japanese leaves. It's just beautiful, isn't it? What's that one there? Oh, look at the, I mean, the colours they use are just intense, aren't they? £44.99. Put that back nicely there. Oh, I'll let cats sort that out. There we go. Thank you. <coughs> and uh, this Caroline Lilly's one. This now, I don't think is this new. I've not seen it before. Brand new, brand new. No, brand new. Oh, right. This is brand new. Right. None of us have seen this before. Oh, oh, it's beautiful. Look. So let's have a look. It's Robin Pickens, and it's called Carolina Lilies. This is going to be a surprise to all of us now. Aren't they beautiful? White on white. Always useful, very bridal. Oh, wow. Yeah, it's fine. Just a machine. Oh, now that's the pattern that the white on white is, but that's obviously green on white there. Oh, look, ferns. Oh, carrots. Oh, they just marked it like baby carrots to me. Then you got your sprigs. Oh, look at the fern on green. What are these are? Brand new today, $47.99. Oh, that's nice. Now, what kind of plant's that? Oh, they're buds. They're the buds, are they? Oh, these are lovely. Mesh. <gasps> Lily. Lily with a pink background. Oh! Doesn't look so much like carrots on that one. Oh, that's very, um, like, Elizabethan, isn't it, that one? You got your oh, that's nice. Moody. Oh, that's nice. I've said that's nice an awful lot. I do apologise. No Sang Street on YouTube. No, Pauline. Pauline, to watch Sang Street on YouTube, you have to go to the Yarn Lane YouTube. Don't ask us why. It's just happened. So if you go to Yarn Lane YouTube, you're to watch it. Oh, Tropical Lilies. Yeah, Robin Pickens, that's right. That one does look like carrots to me, baby. Oh, that's pretty. That looks like bed linen to me. I like this blue. No. Oh, 
Oh, wildflowers don't care where they grow by Dolly Parton is the quote on this one. Oh, that's nice. That would sell really well by the half metre, that one. A beautiful collection. There we go. That's all of those. 47 99 Carolina Lilies by Robin Pickens for Moda. Gorgeous. Keep going through. That's very, very popular, that one. Very popular. Gorgeous. Oh, you got what? We've got an example of a quilt using this collection. It'll take a second. So bear with us. $47.99. Oh, I was going to say that's my house. I <laughs> saw so a picture of my house and it came up then. Oh, look. Oh, that's nice. Could you put it on the big screen, please, so I can see it? Oh, that's lovely. But yeah, she's obviously got some Moda solids that she's used there as well, but look. Oh, that's lovely. Amelia in Carolina Lilies by Robin Pickens. Be nice, yeah, because yeah, sometimes we get the pre-cuts before we get the actual fabric, don't we, but... Beautiful. Forty-seven ninety-nine for that ten-inch charm pack. Or oh, layer cakes. It's from Moda. What's next, Sam? Oh, two seconds. Hold the line, caller. Batik design roll. Now this is gorgeous because it's like the colours of the rainbow. Look at this. Look at these. Gorgeous. So this was my, um, I had this on on my birthday, on my actual birthday, on Sunday. Look at them, they're so beautiful, these batiks, aren't they? Okay, we didn't get set that price. No, oh, no. I didn't think you were allowed to crash the prices. Okay, pink, pale pinks. Yeah, 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 but that's fine because it was a special offer on my birthday. Oh, she's matching my birthday price. All right, here we go. For Barley Batik, you get 20 of them, two and a half inches wide, 44 inches along, and they go to 18 pounds and 99 pence. Colours are beautiful, aren't they? Gorgeous. Going through into the greens. Lime greens. Citrusy greens. Beige. Yours will arrive like that. 18.99. Oh, oh. My first thought when I heard that crash was, oh, what, is Hannah okay? Has she fallen over? No, she's all right. She's all right. Fewer than 20 of those now. Fewer than 20. 18.99. Beautiful rainbow of colours. What would you make out of it? Use a, do Amanda Little's oscillating squares. Will you do a Holby City quilt? She doesn't call it the Holby City quilt. Do -ba -de no, it's not Holby City, is it? A, which is the one that has the, that line, is that casualty? Casualty. Yeah. Uh, and uh, uh, what else, what else do we do? with? Oh, we do so many different designs with jelly rolls, don't we? Mandy Shaw's jelly roll uh, pattern would be nice in this as well. Now, loads of you got this in your basket. Please, please, please check out. Otherwise, you're going to miss out. So many of you. Well, I'm not surprised because she wasn't supposed to reduce the price, was she? On my birthday, we had people multi-buying this. Oh, look. Gorgeous depth of colours. Gorgeous day in Durham, says Jean. I don't know what he's doing here, Jean. 
Is it nice? Oh, they've just put, they've just opened the gallery door and it looks beautiful outside. Look at that turquoise and the aqua going into that lovely lilac. Yeah, no, it was beautiful weather yesterday afternoon, yeah. Anna was here for 12 hours yesterday. Lovely and warm when she left. She had a dinner outside last night in a yard. You went out? Again? She met a friend. Oh no, that sounded wrong. That sounded wrong. She met a friend for, to talk about projects for her MA and they went out for dinner instead. Beautiful, isn't it? Oh, Bruce went out yesterday as well. Before he did what? Oh no, he had an accident putting the rubbish out. Oh no, a kidney bean tin cut him across the hand. 1899, he's fine though, he's in work. He got here out. He doesn't look any paler, so he kind of, he kind of lost that much blood. Single figures on that one now. Remember, that's how yours will arrive. Beautiful. Is that... Uh, one, one, two, three, four, one, two... Yep, this one. I can see a hair now. I've not seen this one either. These are... Now, you're saving £14.99 if you buy all... The, the only way you can buy these days all together, they, they don't come singly. So, I'm going to have to stand up because some of these are enormous. Look. Hannah, Hannah didn't hear that one earlier. When they heard the crash, they thought you'd fallen over, Hannah. But you're all right. Pam Minihani. Good morning, John. Everyone, just back from the school run. It's glorious outside today. Right, so, this is a, a, a bundle... You pay 62 96 but you're actually saving 14 99 So this is your big fat quarters. You see, I've not even seen this one. So you get four big fat quarters on there. Right? You get... What's this one? Oh. Oh, this will be the cushion. There's a cushion. Is that a cushion? Upside down. Folk dancing hairs, that's a creative cushion. Lovely. And then this one here. Is another creative cushion. What was that one then? Hang on, let's have a look then. So that was like the um, round with the fighting hairs. This one here is the big buddy, or it's a big hair. And then this one here. Looks like five inch squares to me. Yeah, there you go. You see, now that one would be normally 14 99 so you can imagine you getting that one for free. And then there's your two and a half inch strips. So you'd be able to do so many projects with coordinating fabrics, wouldn't you? Look. At 62 96 There they all are. Beautiful, aren't they? Gorgeous. Lovely quality cotton as well, these are on. So what would you make? Would you just keep it in your stash till you needed some of it? The cushion one. Oh, you'd make that, the, the, that one. Hannah would make that into a tote bag. You got a lot of extra fabric. So you've got the rabbit, you've got the back and the front two cushion, and the two backs for your cushion, and then those two extra bits on the end there. Yeah, yeah, you can do an envelope back. I think that's what it's for, isn't it? An envelope back. Beautiful. Oh, hang on, I'm still folding this one up. Uh, what's that one then? What's has it got green, cream, blue, and black in it? Yeah. Or is it the lilac one? Uh, 
Oh, that's right. Oh, yeah, yeah, I've got it, yeah. Yeah. Right, so that's that bundle, saving fourteen ninety nine. Just put that over there. Ma with complimentary bundle, complimentary as in going with, not free. Ooh, that's a lovely bundle, even if you don't get the rabbits or the hares. Right, picture on the web does that no just at all. Lilac, soft green, soft apricot, and a nice golden yellow. Oh yeah, Jean's had her breakfast and coffee in the garden. I had a lovely weekend, thank you, Trees. I was here all weekend, but I had a lovely weekend, thank you. Morning, John. Would the X-ray backing be suitable for dressmaking? Yes, Christine, it would. I'll have a look at it in a minute for you. Twelve of those bundles left. Twelve of those bundles left. X ride backing. Yeah, you can make a dress out of this easily. Oh, what kind of dress are you making, Christine? Look. So obviously this is your half a metre. This is your half a metre. If you buy three metres or two metres, whatever you want, it comes in one piece. It's lovely, isn't it? I'll pop it down the table so you can have a good look at the pattern. They've called it red, but it's more of a terracotta brick, I'd say. Beautiful, $8.99. Malka Malka, X ride backing in red. $8.99, 100% cotton. Oh no, it shouldn't be $8.99 at all, should it, really, if you think about it? When you think you can pay £8 or £8.50 for half a metre of 44 inch wide, this is 108 inches wide. Good quality cotton as well. Ooh, Christine, I wonder what I can imagine a dress that. You're doing a button through. Okay, more than half the stock that's gone. It's been, we waited since last year to get that back in. Last year we waited for that. Right, next. Should we do that other bundle of panels? Yep. Yeah. So this one, it's the mushroom one. So there is your mushrooms, look. It's not just mushrooms, what's it called? <gasps> Enchanted wood. No, it's nice, isn't it? I'll put it down for you. Okay, so that's one fat quarter is your mushrooms. Then you've got this one here. Look, it's got nymphs and everything. Yeah, that's a nymph, like a little fairy. Well, I don't know, you have to tell me. Woodland nymphs you have, don't you? Some of them might be fairies. In fact, that's definitely a mushroom fairy. That's a very bulbous mushroom. There's a unicorn. Um, I think so. they look like Victorian drawings. That one's a man, that one there. Awesome. Yeah, 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 yeah. Yeah. Woodland nymphs, I'd call them. Anyway, that's two of them. Then you get the fabric in the kind of grey, I don't know what you call that, like wash. Oh, and there it is with the white background. Same fabric with the white background. Was that with Hugh Grant in it? Yeah, yeah, What was the one with Hugh Grant that had fairies? No, not Love Actually. No. There's one where he's dressed in linen. When he was what? <laughs> <laughs> Half, no, not half, two and a half inch strips. This is a big panel, this one. Nymph, what? I never knew that, nymphs. Okay, so nymphs are human size and fairies are thumb sized. So you're a nymph then, Hannah. 
<laughs> How funny, I never knew that. Well, not that Hannah's an imp, that they were you. Human size. <coughs> Excuse me, you won't get this one, don't we? I've just coughed on that one. Then, this one. Hexes. Gorgeous hexes. I'll put that one on the table to have a look at. <coughs> oh, a nymph can never be male, but a fairy can. Oh, nymph. Oh. It's unusual, isn't it? Mm. Hannah's found all this information about nymphs. Oh, I love this. See, fairies can be boys and girls, but nymphs can't be. <coughs> <coughs> they do what, sorry? They normally live within flowering plants. I'm just getting some um, sanitizer. I've just coughed on my hand. There we go. <coughs> oh, and originally, how did they get around? Right, there we go. So, all four of those you're saving $14.95, you pay $54.97. The fat quarters, the stripes, the five inch squares, and the hexes. Oh, fairies were originally evil. Oh. Right, um, Derek, good morning, Bruce, Hannah and John. It's freezing here, windows are shut and the heating's on. In Scotland? Oh, uh, I love in the book, I think John should become the next Agatha Christie. Oh, thank you. Yeah on the Orient Express in my garden. Uh, Cheryl Bridge, good morning John and gang. It's dull and overcast here, so glad my fence post got painted yesterday. I'm down in the dumps. Oh, uh, uh, but she's got us to cheer her up, that's good. Right, moving on. Complimentary bundle. No, bored now. Bored of fairies and nymphs. Now 14, nine, nine. it's another lovely bundle. You've got the shutters, the black, the duck egg, and the ivory. <coughs> oh, excuse me, we're all coughing and spluttering here today. I'm copying you. That's lovely. Even if you can get the panels, that's a beautiful bundle, that one. Fabulous. Lewis and Irene. This one. Five fabrics. Two and a half metres of fabric. Hannah's Flowers, this is called. I think there's more than just you. You're not the only Hannah in the world. She is. So you're half a metre of each, that's like little sunshines, that's little sprigs of flowers, that's little rose bushes of flowers, uh, twirls, and then you full, oh, that's got a songbird in it as well, that one. Singing away to its heart's content, £34.95. pence. Oh, Dawn's cutting out teeny tiny hexes. Claire says it's glorious where she is. Oh, yes. Who sent that in? Kay says, how'd you get more names if they're all girls? Good question. Moving on. Alice Caroline, uh, five inch squares. 
16.99, these are gorgeous to gift these. Then these are lawn, these are cotton lawn, not your quilting weight, Len, wait. Look how beautiful these are. Now they're all different, all 20 designs are different. They're all five inch squares. This is what you'll get, but they're all different. You don't get to repeat, look. Some of them you wouldn't even know were Liberty, would you? See, that one screams Liberty, but that one not so. Have a little pink, a pink floral. Beautiful, aren't they? Oh, look at that. Like a William Morris, that one, is there? Some of these could be Liberty Prince that Alice Caroline has recolored. Because she's allowed to do that. Aren't they lovely? Very delicate. Gorgeous for piecing. Actually, does she, they, put, they normally put a suggestion on the back of the packet, don't they? Oh, yeah, there you go. Cushion. All little cards. You can buy some of these. Then at one o'clock, pop over to Hobby Maker. See Cat, produce a cat. And uh, maybe they'll make cards with them today. Did you buy anything? Oh, look at that. Look at their little strawberries there. No strawberry thief. Oh, yeah, there he is. It's strawberry thief. But that's been recolored, hasn't it? I've never seen one that's blue with the strawberries colored in. That's nice, isn't it? And then this shadow one now. Oh, come on. Come on, John. There you go. Like leaves at night time, that one, isn't it? Oh, I can't pick them up. Hang on. Being all fingers and thumbs today. There you go. Last couple. Very bold. Sixteen ninety nine for twenty five inch cotton lawn squares, five inches from Liberty, from Alice Caroline. They're beautiful, aren't they? Sixteen ninety nine. They'll fit in the envelope. You could post those as a gift to somebody, couldn't you? Be a nice little present. Some of you might be on their own. Or some of you might be still suffering with COVID or something like that stuck in the house. It's weird, isn't it? It's still around. Still around. Okay. Now, can I squeeze a couple more in and then I've got to go because Becky's warns here. That's right. This one. This is lovely. Mega bundle, mega bundle at Moda Paisley Rose. This one's called now maybe a half a metre of each of these. Half a metre. Okay, and you get a half a metre for free. So, you get the uh, gold one with blue flowers, the little sprig flowers. Crashing! That's apricot and purple, lovely combination. Then that's nice, isn't it? Beautiful. Oh, look at the paisley. That's nice, isn't it? Message on my bottom. Morning, John. I'm introducing my daughter to Sewing Street this morning. Please say hello to her. Her name is Tony. Hello, Tony. Welcome. Welcome and bienvenue. Welcome. Ete, et autre stranger. Right, that's nice. That's lovely. How's that one? How's that one? Oh, that's gorgeous. It's got a 50s vibe going on with that one. What else? Got? Oh, oh, no, that's even nicer. Look, in the same pattern, in a different colour, look. Oof. What's the quote? Too wild to last, too rare to break. Oh, hang on. Too wild to last, too rare to break. Oh, Atticus, that's from. Okay, then we've got the blue one. Oh, and then the nighttime paisley. 67.41 you've got there. Brilliant. And Hannah's just taking some money off that. She sh Half a metre for free. Oh, yeah, and I'll do them with a still because that back, uh, uh, cat's there. Right, the machines are back in stock. Be ahead of the game. Which one? 
Sewing machine first, sewing machine first, £3.99, split pay, £133. Back in stock, back in stock, it has 250 stitches, it has a three year warranty, it has three alphabets all in uppercase, uh, and loads more. You'll see Stuart using that tomorrow. Comes with an extension table and a hard case and lots of feet. So you'll see, now what I'm saying is buy it today, sit back tomorrow and watch Stuart doing his demo. So that's the sewing machine at £399. Yep, it's the same deal tomorrow. Oh, it's a deal, that's the price. That's how much it is, £399. Uh, but even more, and I don't mean to be rude about the sewing machine, but even more excitingly, when they launched the embroidery machine, they completely and utterly sold out. We now have them back in stock. £599, split pay, uh, £200, isn't it, really? £199.66, something like that. It has a four-inch hoop. It has 45 uh, inbuilt Disney stitches, uh, Disney designs, which you can use for you and for gifting, but you cannot sell them. But the others it's got inbuilt into it, you can sell those. And it has a USB stick, so you can do more as well. Oh, and if you have a software that digitizes, you can do your own logo, Hannah's saying. Don't know what that means, but I just said it. Hannah's company. No, thanks. Be friends with Hannah because no one else is. That kind of thing. Gorgeous. Now, uh, there's loads and loads and loads that's gone in baskets today. Please be careful. I mean, I've got loads. I'm not saying please be careful, I'm going to sell out, but remember the well it will do tomorrow once Stuart get, fires it up and he's started to do a bit of embroidery tomorrow they're going to sell out tomorrow it's a bit of a preview before his show tomorrow don't go anywhere Becky Swan is up after break we're doing Crafter's Companion we're going to be doing this we're going to be doing all sorts I'll see you in four miss the live show don't worry we recorded it for you Never miss out on your favourite presenters, guests and makes ever again. Head on over to our YouTube pages to watch back the day's live show and enjoy your favourite demos over and over again. We also have lots of great content exclusive to our YouTube pages, such as product demonstrations, troubleshooting videos and so much more. Subscribe and turn on the bell notification so you never miss a show or video ever again. Have you heard about all of the different ways you can shop with Sewing Street and Yarn Lane? You can either shop on our websites, sewingstreet.com and yarnlane.com. You can also order by phone by calling our friendly UK customer service team. For Sewing Street, call 0800 001 4433 and for Yarn Lane, call 0800 4700 600. And don't forget about the Sewing Street app. Here you can shop all of the Sewing Street products as well as watch the live shows from anywhere. You can download the app onto your smartphone or your tablet by simply searching Sewing Street in your app store. And one final thing, no matter how many times you check out on Sewing Street or Yarn Lane in one day, you will only pay one postage and packaging. Happy shopping! If you're a Sewing Street or Yarn Lane customer, no matter how many times you check out in one day, you will only pay one postage and packaging. So don't wait to add the item you want to your basket and check out. You will only pay one PMP even if you check out multiple times in one day. Are you a fan of Sewing Street and Yarn Lane? Why not join our growing Facebook fans pages? Just search Sewing Street Fans and Yarn Lane TV fans on Facebook and click Join Group. It's that simple. Never miss out on the latest news and updates from our presenters and guest designers, special offers and plenty of chat with your fellow fans. Share photos of your makes, ask for advice, interact with your favourite guests and presenters and be a part of the ever-growing sewing and yarn community. See you there! you heard about Yarn Lane, a TV show dedicated to knitting, crochet and all things yarn, bringing you demonstrations from our expert guests as well as the latest tools.
and find out what's coming up on the show by following us on Facebook and Instagram. Subscribe to our email newsletter or visit the programme guide on our website at www.yarnlane.com. Follow Sewing Street and Yarn Lane on Facebook and Instagram to keep up to date with what's coming up on the show, as well as being the first to know about our amazing offers. Get involved with our competitions that are exclusive to social media. And pick up some top tips from us too. Missed the live show? Don't worry, we recorded it for you. Never miss out on your favourite presenters, guests and makes ever again. Head on over to our YouTube pages to watch back the day's live show and enjoy your favourite demos over and over again. We also have lots of great content exclusive to our YouTube pages, such as product demonstrations, troubleshooting videos and so much more. Subscribe and turn on the bell notification so you never miss a show or video ever again. Have you heard about all of the different ways you can shop with Sewing Street and Yarn Lane? You can either shop on our websites, sewingstreet.com and yarnlane.com. You can also order by phone by calling our friendly UK customer service team. For Sewing Street, call 0800 001 4433 and for Yarn Lane, call 0800 4700 600. And don't forget about the Sewing Street app. Here you can shop all of the Sewing Street products as well as watch the live shows from anywhere. You can download the app onto your smartphone or your tablet by simply searching Sewing Street in your app store. And one final thing, no matter how many times you check out on Sewing Street or Yarn Lane in one day, you will only pay one postage and packaging. Happy shopping! If you're a Sewing Street or Yarn Lane customer, no matter how many times you check out in one day, you will only pay one postage and packaging. So don't wait to add the item you want to your basket and check out. You will only pay one PMP even if you check out multiple times in one day. Sewing Street have our very own app. You can now watch and shop from anywhere. Simply download the app from your app store onto your smartphone or tablet, then log in or create an account and you're done. You can watch us live from anywhere, browse all our recently played items and pre-orders so you never miss out on any show deals and message the studio to say hello at any time. And remember, you can check out as many times as you want and only pay one PNP all day. up to date with what's on Sewing Street and Yarn Lane, as well as all the latest news and special offers by signing up to our email newsletters. For Sewing Street, head on over to www.sewingstreet.com, scroll down to the bottom of the homepage, type in your email address, click the envelope and you're done. It's exactly the same for Yarn Lane. Head on over to www.yarnlane.com, scroll down to the bottom of the homepage, type in your email address, click the envelope, and that's it. You are now subscribed to both Sewing Streets and Yarn Lane's email newsletters. Never miss out on the latest news and special offers ever again. Becky Swan's here. Hello, <laughs> Becky Swan. Hello. Not we matching today, yeah, aren't we? Really? Very I do lovely. like that shirt. Very, very Thank nice. Thank you very much indeed. Right, um, before we start, Becky, uh, June's fallen down the stairs, but she's all right. She thinks she's just sprained her ankle. Gemma says good morning. And Margaret, I will leave lots of time because I'm leaving the home, that the home, the house. Oh, don't. I said to Margaret, Mar in the village, you know, Margaret from the village, she sold up. And I said, oh, he let moving into a home, Margaret. I looked it up. It's the most glamorous, <laughs> stately home with all flats and houses and everything like that. Didn't go down well. Anyway, Becky Swan, how are you? I'm very well, thank you. Now, what are you doing with brightly coloured nails like that? I know. Do you know, my mum said, oh, I love your nails, but did they run out of nail varnish at the oh. salon? It's a little bit rude. It's very rude. I thought I'd go for something a little bit brighter. Yeah, little as tips. We're just going them up, up there yeah. overhead there. 
Oh, hang on, no, we're not. The camera's going against there them. Again. There you go. Yeah, something a little bit different. Yeah, yeah, because <laughs> Kat, producer Kat, she has all different colours yeah. like that and everything. Anyway, what are you here to show us today? What are we going to um, do today? We're going to be using our um, quilting pattern guide. So this is a way of being able to turn your sewing machine into a quilting machine. Oh, fantastic. So great if you don't have you know, access to a big quilter, um, quilting machine, you can quilt all these different shapes on your own. So they're really, really clever. They're very, they look very simple when you look at them but I'll show you some of the samples that you can make they're very very clever fantastic so the bundle to start with is we have four we have four of the rulers in here so you've got here you've got uh, oh come on John orange I've got peels. all the different I've got the circle I've got the clamshell I've got the orange peel and I've got the apple core all four of those now in a minute I have got a bundle of two and two as well but if you want all four you're saving 50% should be 75.96 and you get all four of those and that, well, it's, you're getting two for free basically aren't you getting two of those now they do look a bit odd don't they because they don't look like that's why I got confused I tried looking at the ruler rather than the shape you don't need a Gemini machine for these. This is purely a sewing machine, yes, isn't it? Yes, that's absolutely right. Yeah. But what you must need. Do you need a foot then? Do you need a special yeah, foot? Yeah. So um, I'm going to. I'm using my machine, um, and, and that comes with a, a slightly different shaped foot. Comes in almost like an oval shaped foot. What you actually need is a circular foot. So, so but it's called a free motion machine embroidery foot. Free motion. But but the a lot of them one. got a ruler foot. You know the round ruler foot. That's what you need to use yeah. these. Yeah. Yeah. So they're, they're very easy. They're very easy to use. They just take a little bit of practice. It's a little bit like anything. You've got to have like loose shoulders yeah. when you're using them. Um, but I thought I'd bring a few samples so you can see how they look. So this one is the orange peel um, shape that we've got here. And down the side, um, which you'll probably not quite be able to see, are the different patterns that you can make with this. So you can start seeing, you can make things that would be um, sort of quilting your, your, you know, your items or sort of doing sort of edgings. Um, there's all sorts of different things you can do. But I've actually brought the finished samples here. So you can see just from that shape, just from this shape here you can make all of these oh brilliant so um like i say they well, do different sizes as well yeah because you're using different parts oh, of these brilliant. you've got three different sizes in each one so this one is the orange peels so you're doing sort of traditional kind of orange peel shapes here but then you could make them into little flowers um so this one is using the different shapes in different places um and then this one you know we've got more more different that's like a traditional here. lot of fabric designers use that yeah. pattern a lot don't they but this is quite difficult to do if you haven't got a, a, um, a quilting machine uh, yeah home. exactly um, and you can change any sewing machine into into this you no know, by using this being able to use it as a proper um, quilting machine so this is all a more traditional sort of circular one well, this would look great in you no know, just a, a, a simple block yeah um, this kind of quilting and then again you've got these kind of shapes as well then this one is the apple core so again you've got these sort of slightly different shapes so if I show you this shape here you can see they're similar um, uh -huh. you've, in that you've got three different sizes here um, then you can you can see you've got different sort of curves and shapes here again you've got all of your different um, designs you can put down on this side here and then you can see all oh, of these wow. different shapes so it really does open up more possibilities for you using uh -huh. your ordinary sewing machine well, that's now that one you there that's like a sashko design isn't it, it? Is. they call that a yeah. sashko design don't yeah. they yeah oh yeah absolutely <coughs> and you can see by using those little shapes you're getting is almost sort of these little kind of app, like you say apple, apple cores. Cores. yep could be called that for a reason yeah, really. <laughs> but this is almost like um you know that sort of a black work uh, and red work you can get that that's like that kind of feel to it yeah here, but on a sort of much larger scale and even things like this of so putting these around um you know your binding your edges of your quilts and um, these could look really quite spectacular pussy cats. are they meant to be pussy cats i don't know they, they could, look they like cats looking over a wall yeah that would be quite nice wouldn't it you know if you're doing a little um quilt with little yeah. cats on it that's a good idea I didn't think about that one um this one is the circles again you've got three different sizes in here um, and we do put little lines up here and this is to help you um, organize yourself when you're putting everything together and I'm going to show you what I mean by that so a little bit later on I'm going to do a demonstration and I'm going to divide my piece of um, fabric up into sections and I'm going to make sure each section lines up with these little lines oh, okay. and then that keeps everything nice and smooth uh -huh. and, and in the order it should be oh that's like was it what was it called when you oh you're not old enough I, I, yeah I can't, not can I just you put a circle in a circle and put a pen in yes, it and went like that spirograph spirograph, spirograph that's it that's yeah. it I do remember that. I never had one. I always wanted one. Oh, never got you? one. Should have asked one for my birthday. Yeah. Oh um, yeah, because it's Becky's birthday yesterday. 
All the best people are due. Yeah, exactly. That's what I reckon. Exactly. Um, these ones, you know, you could make a really beautiful quilt with like these kind of hills in there. There's all sorts of things you could do. And clouds. I'm saying clouds. clouds yeah. That. Oh, look the at that rainbow one. Rainbow kind of one. Or this is, you know, sort of like waves. Um, I saw a quilt, um, which is one of my favourite quilts, with little peeking pandas. Have you oh, seen yeah, that one? Joe Carter, yeah. Joe Carter. So that, yeah. that one, you know, quilting on top of that, yeah. perfect, absolutely ideal. And then obviously sort of traditional um, circles, using those circles to create um, the, the kind of um, flowers, kind of thing I remember doing with my um, set of compasses. Yeah, exactly. Yeah, 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 yeah. And again, we've got the final one, which is the clamshells, which don't look like clamshells from the, this um, point here. I think we've got one of those clamshells um, almost... But you're, you've almost sort of got a half here, and again, you've got all your different um, instructions down here. Um, you've got these ones here, these kind of clamshells that you've got here. Then making more of a flower kind of shape, and oh, then these oh, ones as well. Oh, that's nice. So really, really clever, clever items to have in your sort of sewing arsenal um, if you're going to be doing some quilting and you don't. I mean, if I'm going to quilt a large. Um, a, a large quilt I tend to send it away to be done because yes. I don't have the space but being able to do it like this on your machine you can absolutely sort of mm. do all your own quilting so it's a really good thing to have so remember this bundle includes all four of these you get all four so you're paying for two and getting two for free so you've got your apple core you've got your uh, orange peel you've got your circle and you've got your clamshell all four of those you get for £37.98. Uh, uh, so you're buying two, getting two for free, basically. Oh, quarter of the stock's gone already. Quarter of the stock has gone already. We haven't even shown you a demo yet. <laughs> so what I'm going to do here is I'm going to be using this item. Um, oh, yes, yes, yes. Yeah. So this is um, something we've got on the show. Um, this is... Um, reference John's got guide. It, yeah, John, the reference guide. John's got it all in the packaging so you can see what it looks like um, if you can't quite see it on my, on my, um, my mat here. But it's a really clever piece of kit because it's got um, all these various lines on there and little gaps for you to put your heat erasable pen or your tailor's chalk through so you can mark out on your piece of fabric um, where you want everything to go. Um, so make sure that everything's nice and straight and this is particularly useful for when you're using using these quilting, pat quilting pattern guides. So I'm just going to line up. I've already pre-cut um, some fabric. So I've just got some cotton with some batting in the middle and I've used some of our adhesive spray um, to spray it on. Um, and I, I did, couldn't find my... Um, Oh, but my iron was being used by my son doing the ironing, so I just used my hairdryer on it. Oh! And so as long as you've got some kind of heat, that yeah, makes yeah, it a yeah, permanent yeah. Um, <coughs> adhesion. Um, so what we're going to do is I'm just going to line this all up and I'm going to draw in these lines across here. So obviously because I'm using my heat erasable pen, um, I know that I'm going to lose those, those shapes, those marks um, at a later date if I don't need them. Now what I can do is I can move everything and line up so I can do um, other lines um, in, in different places. So oh, I, I see. Move yes, it all yeah. around so you can have multiple different um, sort of lines going around in a, right. in a circle. Yeah. Um, but I'm just going to manage with those ones at the right. moment. I don't need anything else. And I'm going to use these in order to just make sure that I've got everything in place. Now, what I will do is I'm just going to use this here and I'm just going to join the centre points up just to make my life a little bit easier when I'm using that quilting pattern guide. Um, there we go. Just use that just there very quickly, just to make sure I've got a central point uh -huh. there. Now, um, as we said before, we're using um, a free motion machine embroidery foot on this, um, and it's worth having your um, your sort of what's the word? Extension table. That's the that's the job I'm looking for. Um, now, um, one of the things you can do is you can use. Um, we have a, an applique sheet, and you can use one of those. And it's almost like a silicone mat. Yeah, yeah, that yeah. You just put under, underneath, but actually it works okay without worrying about. Okay, this. do I need to drop my feed dogs? You do. Yeah, okay. absolutely. Now these have got like a, a rough surface to them. Um, when we've got both, both this one and this um, this here, they're slightly sort of frosted, I suppose, and that gives you a little bit of grip. But if you did want a little bit more grip, you can always use our spray. So we've got the um, oh, spray. This is let me just grab. It's a spray, spray and stay you spray, want to put on this. Thank with you. It. Spray and stay. So this is the blue one. So yeah. this is the one we used. Um, we've used in the past where we sprayed it onto the back of things like your ruler and it gives it a little bit of grip. Um, so if you did need any more grip, you can absolutely use it for this. 10% um, off, should be 7 dollars you get it for 7 dollars today. 
So you, you can also put it on the back of rugs yep. to stop them slipping. Yep. Put them on the back of your rulers. Yep. You can put all sorts of things like that just to stop yep. it. And it doesn't, it's not tacky. No. So you put it on the back of your ruler, the back of your ruler isn't sticky or anything, no. it just stops it moving, it just, doesn't it's, it? It's quite clever because when um, I used it and I thought, well, I want, no, I was going to take, going to almost wash it off. But actually, you don't wash it off. It, it wears off over time. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But, you know, it, it doesn't come off on anything, as it no, were. No. But sometimes you get you know, bits of fluff, especially if you're losing a lot of batting, you get a load of fluff on there. Just run it under the tap and all that all that fluff just comes off but you're still left with that adhesive brilliant well, not adhesive that gripping uh -huh. effect so it's really it's quite grippy. useful grippy right so what i'm going to do is i'm going to pop this over to my sh my machine so i've already dropped my feed dogs and what i want to do is i want to put my um th this sort of nests just inside um the ruler so if you can see um where i've got here um it's just going to nest inside so this is why you need a circular um, uh, foot rather than the one that may come with your machine which may have maybe more of um, an oval shape uh -huh. you need something that's circular um, but what I'm going to do is I am going to choose I'm going to use this one actually I'm going to use a medium sized one rather than the large and I'm just going to line everything up here so if you can see on right, I don't my, know how, I'm just going to say I don't that? know how we're going to see this if I show you here, yep. there, so you can see um, behind here, we've got these little um, lines. These are the little lines that are going to, uh, I'm going to match up against these lines on my fabric. So if you can see that, if I hold it up like that, you see them? So when I'm, when I'm working on this, I'm going to line up against those sort of um, little lines on the fabric with these lines here. And that, that's going to ensure that I try and keep everything nice and straight. Can you see that? Yeah. So, you can see that. so that's that's what I'm that's what I'm planning on doing. So you don't stick the you don't stick the ruler to the the fabric or anything like that. You just literally the the yep. stick and spray makes it stop moving. It just kind of you're yeah. just going to hold it in place. But actually, I'm, I've not used it on this. I've just I've just left it as it is because it's got a bit of a grip. To oh, it. so you got a grip so on you, it. So okay. you see, if if um, your fabric is quite perhaps if you've got a lawn or something yeah, like yeah, that, yeah. you've got a little bit more slippiness yeah. for want of a, a better better word. So I'm just going to line that up here, and I'm going to drop my um, foot down. And it's always a challenge doing this when you're standing up. Yeah. So you're going to hold onto your fabric, and you're going to hold onto um, this um, this sort of guide here, and you're just going to use your machine, and you're just going to keep that foot along the edge of that ruler. So I'm not moving my ruler. Well, I am moving. I'm moving the ruler and the fabric together. And the fabric together. all together, yeah. Yeah. Um, and then I can just move my foot. And I can move this. Just going to line that up again. So I'm lining up my, my grid lines I've left on my fabric with the little grid lines that are on the actual um, uh, guide. And I'm just going to move that around. Have you got, did you change the size of your stitch or does it not matter? Um, I, I, I would normally change it to um, a slightly smaller stitch. I haven't changed it because I wanted you to be able to see while okay. I'm doing it. Yeah. So I'm just going to, and I, I've, I've not gone back and forth um, at the beginning and end yeah. um, just, for, just for quickness. Quickness. But you would do in real life? Yeah, I would yeah. do in real life. Yeah. So I'm just going to, each of these little um, lines that I've, I've laid out, I'm just going to drop this in. And obviously, as you become more adept at this, you will work out the speed that you need, because that's one of the things you need to check is your, your tension, your under-machine um, under tension, um, because that might be slightly different, because obviously you're moving your fabric uh -huh. um, here and there. Um, so you may have a, a sort of slightly, a bit of a change in the um, tension. But once you sort of practiced a few times, you will work out what works for you and how fast you can go. So I'm going to do a couple of more, so you can see the kind of thing that we're doing. So I'm, I'm creating a bit of a flower uh -huh. here. And which ruler are you using? This one is the clamshells one that I'm using here. I'll just lift that up and I'll just trim those threads here. You can see how that's building up. Okay, so I'm just trimming those threads 
from here. So you weren't you, you weren't see? cutting the thread after each line? No, you, I you haven't just, done that. I'm just yeah. going to trim that there. But you can see, take that one off. Um, I haven't used all of the um, the grid lines that I've drawn on no, here. No, 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 no. But you can see how that works. Obviously, that one's a little bit wiggly, but we won't worry about that one. Uh, uh. We'll, we'll concentrate on these ones. And then you could go over this with your um, sort of larger ones, and you could do the same sort of thing. So you oh, wow, get, yes. So there's all sorts of things you can do. Then you can flip things over, so you can do the other side. Um, so you, you're creating sort of more of a clamshell um, kind of shape over here. There's lots of things you can do with these. And all of that is in those um, sort of different designs are down here. So you can see down the side all those different shapes. So this is the kind of one that I'm doing at the moment, which is this almost, it's almost a bit like, um, uh, like a starfish kind of look to it, isn't it, this one? Oh, yes, this yes, one yes, here. yes. But you can create these, these sort of more intricate ones where you're using multiple shapes, multiple sizes in there to create that kind of design. But that's the kind of thing that you would put together. So it's all done in exactly the same way. Um, but you can see using these grid lines helps me um, ensure that everything's kept um, accurate, especially if you're going to be creating this um, overall shape. Now, if you were going to be doing something else when you wanted to do things along a line, you would work in exactly the same way in that you would use this um, here and you will create your line going across like this and you'll use that as a, a, an idea to ensure that when you're using your um, your, your shape uh -huh. you're keeping to that line so you could make one that goes around like this and then stop and then you could just move your um, shape across here so you're just using you're almost doing like a little bit of a wave here. yeah yeah, yeah. we can have a go at doing that one right, while we're, we're talking about it okay now remember you get all four of these in the bundle you're paying for two and getting the other two for free so it's a bundle of four you don't need to come to me cat don't worry so you get the um apple core you get the orange peel you get the circle and you get the clamshell and on each ruler you get the two inch the three inch and the four inch <coughs> Should be seventy five ninety nine, is it? Seventy six ninety nine. Oh, seventy five ninety six. Sorry. It's a massive saving, isn't it? Yeah, half price. If you don't want to pay all four, you think you're oh, in a minute. I will be able to do bundles of two for you. If I just open that one up now, so you can see here by using that grid line along sharks. the side, you got sharks. yeah, like sharks or waves, and then there's nothing to stop you from doing your next row, doing it from a different angle. Uh -huh. You know, so you can flip it over and have that? the oh, waves go. going the other way. Yeah. Um, so there's there's lots of different things you can do with this, not just the um, designs that are left on the packaging. You can really sort of mix and match with uh -huh. these, um, and they're, they're they're quite versatile because you know this would look great. Or very, and if you did just kind of a nautical kind of themed quilt, having this around the, the edge border, uh -huh. that would look really good. And that would be something that you would in in you no, know, you would be using some kind of template to draw on, of course. and then having to use your machine. But you Follow obviously get it. a better kind of shape by pulling everything up against this edge. Here. Right, uh, if we just, Hannah's made a slide because you couldn't see the different patterns down the side. But on down the side of the packet that, uh, that Becky keeps saying, look, you can see there all the different shapes that um, uh, you can make with each one. <clears throat> That's only a basic. You can play around and make, like Becky said, you can make more and more and more shapes with them if you wanted to. They're the four in the bundle. You get all four, 50% off. I can show you these again because they yeah, make, yeah, yeah. They, they, they make, they the make a better idea, don't they? So you can see here um, how the effective these look. So you can see that we've got sort of slight grid lines on here, and we've used um, we've used that in order to uh, make sure we keep that nice sort of symmetry when we're using them. But you know, this is the kind of thing that you can create using these. So these ones are with the um, orange peel here. They do look really effective, and there's so many different things you could do with these. I mean, I think you know, you once you start quilting and and sort of opening up the kind of quilting that you can do, because you know, stitch in the ditch always seems to be my go-to kind of quilt because it's, because it's quick and easy. Yeah. Um, but this sort of opens up the uh, the opportunities that you can do, and you're absolutely right. These are very much sort of sashiko kind of patterns to them, aren't mm -hmm. they? You know, if you've done a little bit of sashiko and you want to start, you know, quilting um, around the edges, those would be absolutely great. And um, so we've got some more 
here. So these ones are our apple core um, shapes, I believe. Yeah, these are all apple core here. Um, and again, you know, using these apple cores up here, um, this is the same. This is so find clever. Is this is the same shape? This, this whole thing has been made using these particular shapes, but you get this really effective um, kind of sort of um, it was like a mandala shape here uh -huh. with those little um, uh, apple cores over the top there. Uh, we had a question, um, does it matter about a, a high shank or low shank? I don't think it will do. No. Na, 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 before, like when you bought, you'd buy Westerly rulers, you had to buy the, whatever your machine was, high shank or low shank. As long as you got the right foot for your machine, then it won't matter so much. Uh, so you need a free motion... <laughs> Machine embroidery first. But machine, but, but, but if we, if we just take, can we take, take your, have we finished doing any stitching yeah, with this? Take yours off so we can show you what it looks like. Lots of machines will come with them. Some, the brother doesn't come with it, but you can buy them. Not, we haven't got them in stock, but you can buy them brother. Or if you've got an Elna, just ring the, at the um, um, Elna and they'll be able to sell you one there. Because it's, I'll, I'll show it to you now. It's the one that you use for ruler work. Um, somebody's asking about how thick the acrylic is. I was just trying to see if it, it was written down anywhere. Right. Right. Have a look at the. If you look at the Can foot in Becky's hand, you have to do it from upstairs. It's also called a darning foot. This one as well, isn't it normally? Right. Oh, I see. So it's like a darning foot, but it's got the definite ruler work circle on the bottom there. But it needs to be round, obviously. Yeah, and you find that some machines come when they have their free motion machine embroidery foot. They're an oval. Yeah. Um, so they, they, those ones won't work on this. You do need a circular one, but you can um, you can quite easily get them. My, mine's been adapted very slightly, so I've got a slightly different one. But you do, you're right. You get a low shank or a high shank yeah. foot. Yeah, and if you just have a look at whichever foot, whichever machine you've got, just um, ring you'll your manufacturer. They will yeah. tell you because my Elna doesn't come with a round one like that. But I know that the new Dukies come with those automatically. Yeah, and you've got like this sort of um, spring inside yeah. it, and that, um, and the way it comes off, you just have you sort of undo the screw on your sewing machine. So rather than normally with a, changing your foot, you might just sort of knock that little clip at the back. Um, you have to take the whole um, thing and clip the whole thing yeah. back together again. But yeah, that's how it does. All right then, right. You need to screw something else to your I machine, do, yeah. don't you? So that's the bundle for the four. That's the bundle for all four for £37.98. So you get the apple core, the circle, the clamshell and the uh, orange peel. But you might not want all four. So we've got bundles of twos, haven't we? Fruit and... Hang on. Yeah, 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 that day you were just getting confused then. That was, was my bad. Fruit, apple core and orange peel. 19.99, special price. 37.98, they should be. Saving over 45% on those two. So that's the fruity one. And, oh, have you got something else, sorry? There you go, that's what you can make with those two. That's no, fine. Hang on, it's just got lost, there it is. Okay, and then the other one's called what? Oh, shapes. Uh, this one is your circle and jaw. Yeah, clamshells, hang on, I've got the wrong one. There you go, circles and your clamshells, yeah, there you go. Yeah, yeah, right one. Circle clamshells, nineteen ninety nine. Do you want the um, samples again? Uh, they're just going to come in on the on the on onto these to show the different all the different. Um... Right. So this one here is your clamshell one, obviously. That's your clamshell one. Then we've got the uh, circular one. Comes two, three, and four inch. 
These are normally eighteen ninety nine each, remember? Okay, that's it. I'm just going to redo the first two so you can see the different styles of those as well. So that was the shapes. Now this is the fruit. This one is your apple core. So many things you can do with one shape, isn't it? And then this one here is your orange peel. This is the one I think you'll use the most, the orange peel one, to be honest. They're eighteen ninety nine each normally, remember? So you're getting two for nineteen ninety nine. So you get paying full price one, getting the other one for a pound. That's what we're talking. Oh, the most popular option at the moment is all four. Yeah, because you, you're getting 50% off this. You get 50% off all four of them. It's not 37.98 each. That's for all four of them. And once you start having using them, you can then mix and match them. Oh, yeah, yeah, totally. You, know, you start making some really kind of intricate designs. What I would do is what you've done. I'd make up loads and loads and loads of quilt sandwiches, mm. like 12-inch square yeah. ones, and just go for it. Just have a play. Right. A lot of you asking about the ruler that Beth used at the beginning as well. This is called the um, reference guide. 10% off this one. 26.99. Achieve accuracy with your quilting designs by using the Gemini Reference Guide. This eight-point guide allows you to mark a range of reference points at different sizes for use with Gemini Quilting Pattern Guides to enable you to create stunning quilting varieties on a variety of projects. But you know what? Even if you're not using a ruler, you can just mark up your fabrics. If you're doing free motion, but you want it to kind of go in a particular order or to a particular size, you can still use it for that as well. 26.99, saving 10%. And it's particularly good because it's big. Yes. Sometimes you get things that are a little bit too small. You've got plenty of space there to really sort of do your whole sort of 12-inch block. Well, I was going to say, yeah, it goes to the biggest block. Yeah. It goes over 12 inches, yeah. yeah, exactly. Right, now we're moving on to uh, dies for um, quilting. Uh, not quilting, for um, piecing, aren't yeah, we? Yeah, that's right. So I've got a bundle, first of all, with... Oh, yeah, yeah. If you haven't got a Gemini machine, do that first. Right. So, you do need... Oh, I'm going to have to move this right to the middle here. Sorry, Becky. I'm just nicking right. away. You do need one of these to use these dies with, right? So, yes. what you get is... This is the one that we've been has been made specially for us. We're down to the last handful of these, really, now. It will always cost you $179.99. And what you get with that $179.99 is you get your two plates like that. You get your, oh, I haven't got all of them here. Have you got the rest of them? Okay. You get your metal plate. You get your magnetic plate. Brilliant, thank you. You get your uh, one for embossing. And then you get, so you get two of these. So you make your sandwich like that. You put your metal in there. You put your shim in there. And then for paper, you can use the magnetic one. And for embossing um, fabrics, so that's your magnetic one. You won't ever use that for fabric. You won't ever use that one for your fabric. And then there's a, like a wobbly one, isn't there? That's the shim. That's the shim that you put in to make the sandwich thick enough for it to go through. And then you also get, they're all in a little envelope that Becky's just, uh, Becky, Kat's just getting out now. Thank you. That's your cutting plate there. And that one there is your, uh, for when you're doing embossing, right? You don't need that one. Hang on. You don't need that one and that one for cutting fabric, right? Put that to one side. So with it now, as a special gift, you get a gift so you can get started straight away, which is worth over £100. You get this one here, which is a diamond cutter, which I used for bunting shapes that I never made in the end. <laughs> no, you didn't make them. no, no, Time no. I got, I got so like out of time that I ran Karen from Wigan and I bought loads from her. <laughs> And then uh, you also get this here, which is a Drunkard's Pathway one. But you can't, you don't just do Drunkard's Pathway. Look at all the different shapes you can do with this. In a six and eight and nine and a twelve inch block. So it means these are for fabric cutting, right? So you can literally, the minute your machine arrives at your door, you can start cutting because they, 
they come as a free gift. We know a lot of you already got this, but I'm just going to say. Oh, now, if you're going to do fat, right, now let me just explain. When, when you get this machine, you can start cutting straight away. This is, the, this is the cut, this is the plate you get, the metal plate you get. Now, it will misshape like that. It's what we call a consumable, right? So that will change shape. And also, these will start getting uh, marks all over them. That, and they'll bend a little bit and things like that. That's what happens. They're consumables. You can buy them from Crafter's Companion. It can be a long time before you have to replace them. But we noticed that when you were doing fabrics, these were really, really, really taking some... Mine at home, you see mine, mine's like a mangled mess now. Right, so what they introduced was these, which are two much sturdier metal plates. Now, if you're only just starting, you might not get them straight away, but I would, I would get them straight away. Because when you use these, you don't need to use the shim. You do, you don't have to no. have the shim at all. You literally do plastic sheet, this fabric cutter, this plastic sheet, and go through. You're going to see Becky using it now. They're $24.99. If you're going to do fabric on them, these are so worth investing in. If you're just going to do paper crafting, don't bother. Don't get them if you're just going to do paper crafting. Or, or just a tiny amount of fabric. But if you're going to use them to be cutting block after block after block, these two will mark, as you can see, like that one. But they're going to last an awful much longer. Right, they're twenty four ninety nine. So they're Becky's own. Those ones there. So you want that, 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 Thank that. You. That's it. So when you, if you just use it with this, the two plastic plates, this, you do have to put the shim in as well. That makes the sandwich wide enough for it to go through the machine. Now the thing about the machine is, when you get it, there's a switch on the back, right? So make sure the switch on the back is switched on. Because it, you, I was pressing my buttons going, well, come on, well, come on, why won't it come on? You have to press the back. Also, don't worry about little hands because this will not, this will not set in motion. And it knows, it's got sensors here and here and here and here. It knows when the proper plate is going through. So if you've got little kiddies who, or people like me putting their fingers in all the time, it's not going to set off and you're not going to crush your fingers. Also, when you place it in your workroom, make sure there's enough space behind it because I set mine up really nicely against the wall. Of course, you come to do it and it doesn't come through the other side. It also has a reverse button, so if it does happen to get stuck, or if you're only cutting a little bit on the plate and you can't wait the 18 seconds for it to go through, you can press the reverse button and it comes back out again. So all of that, 179.99. And this colour is only available here. When I went, when I went to Craft Companion, we had a purple one, which we didn't launch for my show. Normally it's a white one. This one here, Candy Floss, is only available, not just at Sewing Street, at the, at the whole sisterhood, the sisterhood of channels. <laughs> right, I'll let you get on. I've done all my talking. So I'm very je jealous of your purple one. I only have a white one, and I feel quite jealous. You've, You've got, got what? I've only got a white one. Oh. Yeah, I know. Mine's the purple one. Yeah. Right, before we go on, I've got to show you what we're going to be using in this hour, haven't I? So this is a, this is a bundle of four dies, right? So you get jewel in different sizes, look. Jewel. You get clamshell. You get elongated hexy, and you get apple core. Now, look at the different sizes. All different sizes in there. I'm just having a look to see what they are. Four, oh, there you go. Four and four, well, four and a half by five and a half, three and a half by four and a half, two and a, eight by three and a half, and just over two. 30% saving. If they should be 144 pounds, and how much? 96 pence. If you were to buy them separately. Now, if you buy them today, they're 99.99, but you get on split pay. So hang on, what's it say on there? 16 elements, special plus, price plus free die. I don't know, what was the rest of that one there? We'll have to look at the rest of it there. Anyway, it's 99, you're getting a great big saving. How much would it be normally, say, 149? 144.96. It's how much it should be, but it's ninety nine ninety nine today. We'll find out what those graphics mean just now. Anyway, let's move on. Uh, shall I show you the other bundle? It works out as a free die, yeah, exactly. And then the other bundle we've got here: apples, tumbler, and Dresden. Oh, how Dresden! 
This is the other bundle we've got here. Getting the right way up, Tom. 59.95. Should be 84.97. You're getting it for 59.95. The equivalent to a free die. 59.99. There's your top. No, not the 59.99. Apple core. Tumbler, but look at the different sizes. And your Dresden plate. Lovely. Right. So sh show us what you can make with these. Right. So these, right, right. I mean, these kind of shapes, they're almost your bread and butter kind of shapes with, with quilting, aren't they? You know, you're yes. going to get all the bits and pieces that you would need, apart from, you know, your triangles and your squares, which you could cut fairly easily yeah. without having to worry about these. But these are a little bit more um, tricky to cut by hand. Um, so um, you've, as um, John says, we've got four different sizes um, in here. Um, so you can mix and match those. And we've got a couple of little examples on the back of the kind of thing that you can make. Um, so what I'm going to do is I'm going to take um, the second smallest one, um, which is this one here, um, and I'm going to um, use it on uh, cut, to cut it with my Gemini. Now you'll notice that um, if you've ever used paper craft um, dies before, um, they're much thinner. These are these are multimedia dies, and they're thicker. And this is why they can cut through the fabric um, because they've got like a deep edge. They're not sharp, so you, if you put your hands on them and you press down, you're not going to cut yourself. They are just um, it's a pressure of the machine and um, that it goes through. So if you're not using a Gemini, you're using another die cutting machine. You may not be able to cut as many any layers of fabric um, as, as you can with these um, but they, they, they're not going to hurt you if you touch them it's not like it's a sharp um, sort of rotary cutter kind of thing. Should I only cut fabric with these or can I cut paper with them? No you can cut paper with them um, I would just say that um, it, I, I, it, I've used them for all sorts of different okay. things. So particularly um, sort of some of the curves, um, I find those quite useful if I'm, I'm doing some paper cutting and I want that kind of shape. Yeah. So quite difficult to cut otherwise. Mm -hmm. um, so yeah, you could use them for all sorts of things. I would say though, the um, no, key thing is if you're going to be using them for fabric, to have the fabric plates because they, they do get a hammering. You yeah. know, especially if you're going to be buying these, you're not going to be cutting one or two. You're going to be wanting to make a whole quilt out of them. So you're going to be cutting lots of these and you know you don't want the you know what you want things to last as long as possible yeah, so yeah, i would exactly. say those paper uh, paper plates the fabric plates are the way to go uh -huh. um, so i start off with my clear plate i've got my metal plate then i've got my fabric and i'm going to um, i've got my die and i'm going to place that down and um, i'm going to use a little bit of tape i remember to bring Ray! my tape this time no tack tape no tack tape which is quite useful for um, putting my um earpiece attaching my earpiece to my neck I always find that quite difficult. Oh, it's coming away. It's coming away, yeah, yeah, it always does. Um, and then I'm going to put my fabric plate over the top and then my clear plate. And then you're just going to pop that into the machine. But you can cut, I'm only doing a couple of layers of fabric here because I don't need any more. But you can cut multiple layers of fabric. And um, obviously, if you're going to be using a very thick fabric, if you're going to be using something like a denim, you may need to be able to cut one or two or, two or three. Um, but if you're cutting sort of um, quilting, Cotton, you can do sort of eight layers of fabric at a time. Thank you very much. Okay. And obviously that's going to save you huge amounts of time because you don't have to worry about um, sort of cutting those out. And so I'll just put that little bit of tape there. And then you can see that's cut out beautifully. Now if you've got, um, I always think this is quite useful, if you want to sort of fussy cut um, those sort of pieces out, um, obviously using a bit of low tack tape but it's really great because you can actually see what you're doing with mm -hmm. that that shape there so i've already cut these um out and i've got a couple of more um over here now i've already stitched those ones together so those are my elongated um hex hexagons um, and then i've got a few more here so i'm just going to stitch those together now when you join these hexagons you just draw if you've never used these before um you just need to stitch along strip as long as you want your or as wide as you want your quilt to be uh, and then when you've done that um, I'm going to show you how to put these together so you just have to sew these in a sort of slightly different way and um, to the way perhaps you would have sewn um, sort of squares but it's very very simple to do um, and the beauty of using the you know, Gemini is that you're not going to have to spend a huge amount of time cutting all of these if you're cutting these with um you know sort of a an acrylic shape you could probably only cut two at a time oh, because yeah, it yeah. all slips mm -hmm. um, and if you have sort of limited mobility not mobility dexterity, dexterity is the word yeah, i'm looking yeah, for yeah. um well actually even limited mobility because if you're using a rotary cutter and you're you're sitting down it tends to be quite difficult to cut doesn't it, it yeah oh yeah, yeah you want to be to higher above it yes that yeah. kind of um 
weight down that you need to do. Um, so what I'm going to do is I'm going to start sewing these ones together. So I'm going to sew sort of three of those um, together just along this line here. Now, um, because they've been cut with the, the Gemini, they <coughs> don't all match up perfectly. Yeah. So I'm just going to stitch across here um, using a quarter of an inch seam allowance. And that's all been taken into account as well, that quarter of an inch seam allowance. And that's the same with all of our, um, our dies um, for sort of um, fabric. Obviously not for paper because you don't need to worry about a seam allowance for paper. Um, okay. But you can, um, you'll definitely sort of not have to worry about working that out. Just looking for my scissors. Scissors always go missing, don't they? And then um, I'm just going to do a press here, I do a finger press here because I'm not going to worry um, too much about getting my iron out at the moment. And I'll attach that one here, like so. Is it going to be take? Oh, well, you may say it in a minute, but I, 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 I'm not used to seeing uh, elongated hexes going together no. like this. No. Um, in fact, you know, you generally see you know, sort of normal size hexes, don't you? Yeah, yeah. I yeah. did. Um, I used these shapes. I was making, um, I was doing something for a show, and um, we, it was a, I think it was Earth, World Earth Day. So I was looking for something that was um, sustainable. Thank you. Um, yeah. So I was making sort of. Um, uh, washable or reusable makeup wipes uh -huh. and so what I found um, was really good to do is using the larger one and the smaller one and I was making I was almost doing like um quilt as you go kind of situation so I, I cut one of these out of some toweling fabric um, and, and sort of like old flannels and then cut the other side out of cotton and then I was sort of putting them together and, and making them into washable um, wipes uh -huh. and actually it's quite useful because you've got those little corners so when you're what the washable wipes washable makeup removers yeah. when you sort of got those points that's quite good for sort of going around your eyes and so that was a different way of using these rather than using them for patchwork it was a sort of different um, item to do. Uh -huh. So we've got, done those and now we're going, we want to mark we're going these points together. So what we're going to do is we're going to join this one to here and I'm just going to stitch that part here using my quarter of an inch seam allowance. And then can see that that's um, attached here uh -huh. and then I'm going to fold this over and I'm going to join up those points again so you can see I'm joining up that point here that edge of my shape with that one here because the, the Gemini is cut <coughs> excuse me cut it so precisely yeah. it's going to fit together perfectly yeah. isn't it and that's the sort of benefit of um, using something like this because it takes away that guesswork and yes. for me, I always found that I'm, I have to say, I'm a, little, I'm a little bit sloppy when it comes to measuring things out. And I quite, that, I'm sure that's why my dressmaking isn't as, as good as my mum's, um, because um, I, I wanted to get on and, and put things together. Um, I wanted to get excited about doing that. And I didn't want all the hassle of sort of measuring everything out. So what we would do, so we've sewn this, these two pieces here. So you've created uh -huh. like a, a Y seam. And then you'll just carry on doing the same thing. So you're just matching up your points here. I love my like Gemini so. machine. Amazingly accurate for fabric cutting from Trish in Lincolnshire. Well, it is. It is. I've cut all of my ones that I've done in my windows and my cushions and everything. They've all been done on my Gemini machine. <clears throat> well, there's a um, there's a couple of quilts I want to I want to do, and and in the past, you know, I've I've had the fabric for for years, yeah. and um, I've never actually. Do it, done them because I started sort of cutting them out, and I was like, oh, "This is taking forever." Yeah. <laughs> um, and um, you know, you sort of lose interest after a little bit of time. Yeah. But you're right. With, when you've got this, you can sort of start get started making things so so quickly. Exactly. So you can see there how I'm, I'm starting to put that together. So I just continue down this side. Uh -huh. But you can make you can make the top of a quilt no problem in a day by using the Gemini because you're cutting everything out really, really quickly. Yeah. I tend to cut everything out in one go, lay it all out, and then go, go and do the stitching. So it's exactly the same kind of thing. I remember you can cut up to eight, eight layers. And also what you can do is what I do with mine is if, if you've got different shapes to cut out, you've got triangles and, di and diamonds, things to cut out, you can lay them all out on the fabric or have different fabrics. So you're cutting not just one set of eight, you can cut four or five sets of eight at the same time. 
absolutely true. So, and then I've, I've just done this one, but this is using the apple cores. Um, so this is using exact, done in exactly the same way. Um, so you see my dies, my dies are well used yeah. in their packaging. Um, but I've just um, cut um, all of these out using my Gemini. And then it makes it, because you're saying, as you said, it makes it so easy because you don't have to worry about things not matching up. You can see that these points match exactly, despite the fact that I'm, I'm slapdash. Yes. Um, so I can run a couple more of those through so I can show you how I put those together using uh -huh. the glue. Very quickly. Um, so we've got, just take that. Remember, the bundle is for four different dies here. You've got the dual, the clamshell, the elongated hexi, and the apple core for $99.99. Should be $144.96. Was that well remembered or what? That's really impressive. Yep. Yeah. For a man of my age. <laughs> <coughs> and it's on split payment, look, forty nine nine nine. Now, these are all sent to you directly from Crafters Companion. They do not come from our warehouse. Okay. But they're very quick at getting things out to you. You get new, I wonder why you wanted glue in I this hour. Glue, yeah, I wanted glue for this one. So I just I do two very quickly. Yeah, yeah. So what you want to do with when you're joining up these is you want to find the centre points. So I'm just going to fold this over like so, and I'm just going to finger press there. So I'm finding the the um, the long ways the the centre point, and then I'm going to do sort of landscape effectively. Uh -huh. and I'm matching that up. And then I'm going to use a bit of glue. So this is um, our textile glue. I find this is easier than using pins. Right. Um, so I glue this together first of all, and then I would stitch it together. Okay. So we're going to start with just one half first of all. So I'm just going to put a little bit of glue down here. And I'm just doing that first half. I'm not putting glue over both sides. Oh, yeah. And then I'm matching up the two centre pieces. So I'm putting right sides together. So I'm just matching those centre points up like so and then what I'm going to do is I'm just going to stick together that why do you do one half um, just because when you're doing it otherwise you'll get glue over the front of this oh, piece okay, of fabric okay. <coughs> and it just is a little bit easier to do so we're just going to stick the glue around here because obviously you're going around curves and then that is the, the 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 beauty of being able to cut the curves exactly the way you want them to be because if you're cutting curves and you get them slightly out then you know then your your, your quilt looks out doesn't it you yeah, don't get exactly, everything matching yeah. up so i'm just doing the other half down here so i can sew through this glue it's not yep. a problem yep yeah really really good um so I, I i always use pins when i was doing this yeah yeah but they're, they're fiddly they're fiddly well, you can scratch yeah, and you know, if you watched last time I was here, I sewed over a pin and broke the needle. Oh. Um, yeah, doesn't doesn't take a lot. I mean, I'm a liability, on <laughs> Um So you know, it's nice to be able to do it like this. And what I did is I glued all my pieces together first of all, right. and then I then I sewed them on afterwards. Hey, it's glue two ninety nine. So there's a glue there, and then I'm just going to stitch around here using my quarter of an inch seam allowance. I'm just going to go quite slowly just to make sure I've I've got everything. Um, working and it's all um you know we don't get any puckers in it but because you've glued it together um it's a lot easier than fiddling around trying to do this curve with your um with your pins in there <coughs> and trying to take those out but i think it's much simpler to do this way there we go and then i'll just fold that over like that and you can see it naturally wants to fold yeah, along yeah, that yeah. curve and then you've got that just here with your shapes Fabulous. so really really easy for you to do and it's just been cut out with that die here like that okay so the die bundle i've got the bundle this is the bundle of four i've also got a bundle of three to show you in a second so here's the bundle of four Hang on, so I just need cat to come back. Oh, there you go. So you've got your uh, jewel, your clamshell, your elongated taxi, and your apple core in that bundle. Should be 
You're getting it today for 99.99 and it's on split pay. The other bundle we've got for you today is this one of three, which is Dresden plate, oops, uh, apple core, and your tumblers. Should be 84.97, that 59.95 for you today. And again, you can just use it the same way as we have done for the other ones to make your quilt. Very popular, that one. Very, very popular. Message from Autumn, then we'll go for a break. Morning, John. Oh, Joggen and Becky. Just ordered the die set. I can't wait to use it. Uh, loving the interaction. Getting loads of tips. Thank you. Love the shirt. Now, is that you <laughs> or mine? More than I, I think it's yours. I might have to pinch that from you. All right, then. Right, <laughs> I'll go for a break. Now, if I come back bare-chested, you'll know why. <laughs> oh, hey! <laughs> Oh, so I said the other day about um, we'd reduce something we shouldn't have reduced. And I said, you'll get a call from Claire at Native Lighting, you know, a naughty call. And I didn't mean a naughty call at all. And that, everyone's just remembered that. Were lots of people disappointed. Yes. <laughs> yeah, when are you getting your naughty calls? I'm sorry, cause, because hundreds of you bought it. You'll be sitting there waiting for your naughty call. <laughs> yeah, Claire. Claire sitting there going, why are all these people wouldn't text me? <laughs> right, what are you going to do in your next hour then? Uh, what am I going to do? I've got some um, bag making dies. Oh, lovely. So really great for um, little sort of um, wash bags and that kind of thing. Great for gifts. Um, and we've got some hardware as well to go with them. Oh, yes. And some of it, rose gold coloured and rainbow coloured. They're on pre-order if you want to go and have a look. Uh, otherwise, join me for Kits You Will Love. Straight. A what? Oh, and the lion. We've got some of the lion left. Chest of the lion. Uh, straight after this break. Are you a fan of Sewing Street and Yarn Lane? Why not join our growing Facebook fans pages? Just search Sewing Street fans and Yarn Lane TV fans on Facebook and click Join Group. It's that simple. Never miss out on the latest news and updates from our presenters and guest designers, special offers and plenty of chat with your fellow fans. Share photos of your mates, ask for advice, interact with your favourite guests and presenters and be a part of the ever-growing sewing and yarn community. See you there! Have you heard about Yarn Lane, a TV show dedicated to knitting, crochet and all things yarn, bringing you demonstrations from our expert guests as well as the latest tools? And find out what's coming up on the show by following us on Facebook and Instagram. Subscribe to our email newsletter or visit the programme guide on our website at www.yarnlane.com. Follow Sewing Street and Yarn Lane on Facebook and Instagram to keep up to date with what's coming up on the show, as well as being the first to know about our amazing offers. Get involved with our competitions that are exclusive to social media. And pick up some top tips from us too. Miss the live show? Don't worry, we recorded it for you. Never miss out on your favourite presenters, guests and makes ever again. Head on over to our YouTube pages to watch back the day's live show and enjoy your favourite demos over and over again. We also have lots of great content exclusive to our YouTube pages, such as product demonstrations, troubleshooting videos and so much more. Subscribe and turn on the bell notification so you never miss a show or video ever again. Have you heard about all of the different ways you can shop with Sewing Street and Yarn Lane? You can either shop on our websites, sewingstreet.com and yarnlane.com. You can also order by phone by calling our friendly UK customer service team. For Sewing Street, call 0800 001 4433 and for Yarn Lane, call 0800 4700 600. And don't forget about the Sewing Street app. Here you can shop all of the Sewing Street products as well as watch the live shows from anywhere. You can download the app onto your smartphone or your tablet by simply searching Sewing Street in your app store.
And one final thing, no matter how many times you check out on Sewing Street or Yarn Lane in one day, you will only pay one postage and packaging. Happy shopping! If you're a Sewing Street or Yarn Lane customer, no matter how many times you check out in one day, you will only pay one postage and packaging. So don't wait to add the item you want to your basket and check out. You will only pay one PMP even if you check out multiple times in one day. Sewing Street have our very own app. You can now watch and shop from anywhere. Simply download the app from your app store onto your smartphone or tablet, then log in or create an account and you're done. You can watch us live from anywhere, browse all our recently played items and pre-orders so you never miss out on any show deals and message the studio to say hello at any time. And remember, you can check out as many times as you want and only pay one PNP all day. of Sewing Street and Yarn Lane? Why not join our growing Facebook fans pages? Just search Sewing Street Fans and Yarn Lane TV Fans on Facebook and click Join Group. It's that simple. Never miss out on the latest news and updates from our presenters and guest designers, special offers and plenty of chat with your fellow fans. Share photos of your makes, ask for advice, interact with your favourite guests and presenters and be a part of the ever-growing sewing and yarn community. See you there. Follow Sewing Street and Yarn Lane on Facebook and Instagram to keep up to date with what's coming up on the show, as well as being the first to know about our amazing offers. Get involved with our competitions that are exclusive to social media and pick up some top tips from us too. Keep up to date with what's on Sewing Street and Yarn Lane, as well as all the latest news and special offers by signing up to our email newsletters. For Sewing Street, head on over to www.sewingstreet.com, scroll down to the bottom of the homepage, type in your email address, click the envelope and you're done. It's exactly the same for Yarn Lane. Head on over to www.yarnlane.com, scroll down to the bottom of the homepage, type in your email address, click the envelope, and that's it. You are now subscribed to both Sewing Streets and Yarn Lane's email newsletters. Never miss out on the latest news and special offers ever again. Right, kids you will love, kids you will absolutely love, and something went down so well on Sunday. Chest of the line. Now, what a lot of people said was when they looked at the photo, it looked like it was just a little uh, uh, mane going around that. That's not at all. Look, it's beautiful and it feels like my Luther, my ghost. It's gorgeous. $29.99. Now you can watch the demo. You can watch the demo because it was on on Sunday at 10 o'clock. Um, and he's just adorable. But um, something like over 200 and something of these went. How many? 225 went to these, so I've only got a few left of these at 29.99. Now, the only thing you need is st toy stuffing. Everything else comes in the kit. Now, I can't show you the box here because um, Joe's taking it back with her, but you get this fur, you get this is called shaggy. This fabric is called shaggy here. Uh, and it's really, really easy to sew with those. Oh, there you go. Well done, Han. So there you go. So you get the black fur, the black fleece for the nose. You get white fleece for the jowl. You get the eyes. You get the embroidery thread. You get shagger. And you get the really lovely, smooth fabric for the, for the body. Plus, look at these instructions, right? Look at these instructions. They're amazing. Here we go. Look. Uh, the thing about Joe's instructions is, look how brilliant they are. Photographs, writing, everything you need, or every single stage is covered. Lovely. Oh, I don't know why that's got a bit of blue tack in the middle of it there. 
that it's called Chester because of Chester Zoo, where I come from. Well, where I come from. Chester, where I come. And also because Joe thinks I'm always talking about um, uh, Secret Life of the Zoo, which comes from Chester Zoo. So we decided to have a works outing to Chester Zoo. We're all going to go. We're going to get a charabang and go to Chester Zoo. A bus. Right, Joe, so that now the other thing, the other thing, this is to anybody, even if you haven't bought this one, you can go to Joe's website, which is Two Owls Design, and you can download a pattern for free for a little waistcoat for him. What you do is you go to the website, you go to shop, you do the down, you press that on the drop down, and then you um, look for free patterns, and it's a free pattern in there of uh, that waistcoat to fit in beautifully. So that's a free gift. And, and you get the free badge as well. Now, when it's delivered, right, when it's delivered, uh, it comes in a big envelope. The box of the kit is inside the envelope, but so is the badge. So the badge won't be in the box. So don't throw the envelope away thinking the badge is gonna be in the box. It's packed separately in the envelope. We've had people saying they didn't get a badge, but they just threw their envelope away. No, twenty nine ninety nine. He's beautiful. He's so gorgeous, and don't be frightened about using it, working with this um, shaggy fabric because Joe showed us during the demo. Sorry. There you go. Yeah. Beautiful. Twenty nine ninety nine. He's adorable. Look at his tail. It took Joe hours to work out how to do the tail. What's that noise? Have you got diggers going on outside? Hang on, let me just do this. Let me just take my earpiece out a second. It's in here. Sounds like there's a motorbike revving in here, doesn't it? Listen. I don't know what it is. Can you hear it at home? Oh, no, I can't get my earpiece back in. Hang on. Oh, I'll be with you in a second. There we go. Yeah, piece back in. It's a very loud noise in here. 20, uh, I've just made my first purchase. Really enjoying the show. John from Julia in Edinburgh. Julia, welcome to the family. It's the most dysfunctional family you'll ever meet, but welcome. Oh, he's just gorgeous. We were saying uh, yesterday on Sunday about how all of Joe's uh, soft toys have their own personality. She's made him bigger as well. Originally, when she started off, he was much smaller than this. But she supersized him. Well, no, no, because we put him next to um, Marcy, and he's much smaller than Marcy. Yeah? Anyway, he's gorgeous, isn't he? Right, your what's in a knot? Oh, your mouth. Right, let's put that back there. Keep going through for that. Where am I going next, then? Amber makes trio. Yeah, the trio of trios. Now, some, some, I believe some of these aren't available on their own. Right, the sewing room, the only way to get the sewing room is in this bundle, right? So what it is, is they're all the same instructions. Now, Rebecca Reed did this on Saturday, so you can watch on Saturday. So for 49 99 you get the instructions. Then you get the panel. For the now, let me point out there's three in each of these. That's why I'm saying trio of trio. So what's the, what did I just say the first one was? Potting shed. So this is potting shed, look. <laughs> you think Becky does? She leaves pins in on purpose. Right, there you go. So there's a trio of trios there. Oh, hang on, where do you want me to put them? Trio of trios. But what's amazing, I'll let catch you those. You get all three of those on this panel, but look at the inside. The inside's got all your shelves and your pots and your plants and everything like that. That one there's got all your, oh, like all your seedlings are growing. And that one there's just got your writing. So when we say a trio of trios, each of them has three. So in this bundle, you do get the panel for the potting shed. Oh, that's, oh, you said, no, hang on. Right, isn't that weird? I just picked up potting shed and opened the wrong one. There you go. Life. So there's your potting shed. There's all extra bits as well, she said, that you can use. 
So that's your potting shed, you get that. You get the uh, little cottage, which is this one here. She's at Glastonbury now in her crochet trousers, so she won't care what we're doing. There you go. That's your little fact. Now, the, this one's actually got furniture in it. The upstairs has got beds in it, and the downstairs has got sofas and everything like that. There's your larder. Anyway, so that's this one. So you get all three of those on there. Then you also get the sewing room. Now, this is the only way you can get the sewing room because the sewing room sold out on its own. Look, there you go. So the outside of the sewing room, inside of the sewing room. Look. Gorgeous, isn't it? So that's those three, and they're all on here. The, only, the reason you get one set of instructions is because they're exactly the same instructions for all of them. Look, there you go. You're saving £10, I think, isn't it? I think it's £10, isn't it, Hannah? Yeah. Beautiful. So that's all of those, you see. That, now that's the only way that you can get the sewing room. The sewing room on its own has sold out. So you want the trio of trios, £49.99. We had to get more stock in. Everything of this all sold out on Saturday. We had to get extra stock in. At £49.99. Saving £10. And you get the instructions as well. Right, so now on its own... We've got the cottage, which is this one. There you go, thatch cottage. Very popular on pre-order. So this one, you get the panel and the instructions, which I think is outrageous, because if you were to buy the instructions on their own, they'd be 9 99 wouldn't they? It's a big panel, and you can make all three sizes out of that. For nineteen ninety nine, Thatch Cottage. We did laugh on Saturday because I said she just copied her pin cushion, isn't she? She went, no, there's an inside. There's an inside to this one as well. So that's your Thatch Cottage. And last but not least, Potting Shed, which is the one she made for me. I've got this one. I've only got, all right, I've only got one of them. But it's got my name on it. Just really here, isn't it, Hannah? There you go. There's your potting shed, trio of trios. Gorgeous. So now the only way to get the sewing room, if you want the sewing room, is in the three for £49.99. Uh, now you'll need to make 640 to make these. I haven't got it here, but you know what it's like, it's that fusible. You need two, you need two of them to make the three. If you bought the three, right, you need one, you need one packet if you're making one and you'll have some left over. If you're making all three, if you bought the whole mega bundle, you only need two packets because you're only using up just over half of each one. Do you know what I mean? Do you get me, Ari? Ari? That was a catchphrase from time. Do you get me, Ari? Was it, wasn't it? What, Brute 33, wasn't it him? Frank Brute, no, yeah, Brute 33. He what? Oh, does he? Lives in Light and Buzzard, where Hannah used to come from. Factoid. Right, next. Strawberry Thief, William Morris, from Yvonne McTamney. Now she's in. Is it tomorrow? She's in tomorrow. She's in tomorrow. 36 It's beautiful, isn't it? So it's all made of William Morris fabric look. Uh, there you go. Beautiful, so you're getting all your different William Morris fabrics in there. You actually get a strawberry thief in there, look. To 
create that gorgeous wall hanging of 25 by 19 inches. Say that again. Yeah. Okay. At thirty six ninety nine. Beautiful, isn't it? Gorgeous. Right, next. Should be in tomorrow with a block of the month or row it's block of the month, isn't it? Yeah, block of the month, not row. Yeah. Amber makes busy bees craft storage. Yeah, that's this one. Okay, I've got thatch cottage garden birds. I haven't got I haven't got another one. Oh, hang on, is that it over there? Sorry, they've been separated. It's a bundle, yeah, yeah. Craft storage set. Here you go. So it makes the bag, the pin cushion, the um, cover for your... Oh, now, if you bought the um, early bird this morning, you can cover your retractable tape measure, and it's got a scissor keeper there. You get some bosel out of Salville, and you get the panel and the instructions, all for twenty nine ninety nine. I only got a few of these left now. There you go. The bumbly bee is always very, very popular. I've, we have again this week. Oh, no, we haven't now. We haven't now. Gorgeous. I'll tell you why in a minute. You know what I mean, Harry. Good luck. Oh, hang on. You know what I mean, Harry. La laugh out loud. Good old Frank Bruno. Teresa, yes, Teresa, thank you. But was it to advertise Brute for 33? Splash it on all over. I was on every, it was every Christmas. It was on every other advert it was on. Splash it on all over. 29.99. Be careful on that one. Very limited, very limited, very limited. Right, the other Amble Makes Bumblebee panel, which is the one I just tried to show you. This one here is a cushion. It's a um, teapot cosy, a doorstop and coasters for $24.99. Do I get anything else with this apart from the panel? There you go. Everything you need there. Gorgeous. How much is it again? $24.99. Very easy makes. What date was that on? The what one? 9th of June last year. I've, there's been other demos as well. But that was when it was launched, I imagine. Okay, that the oh, you, the three thingies came with that. Yep, next. I have. I've got thatch cottage and garden birds. That right now. This is where we'll see if she copied it, won't we? Oh no, I remember the thatch cottage being having. Yeah, but I could have sworn it was timbered. There are other versions of it. Oh, that's why. There you go, this is the rendered version. It's the same coloured front door, because a picture of her in a, um, you can see that door there, in the picture of her with her crocheted trousers on. Beautiful. 1999, you do get the instructions with this as well. One's a doorstop, one's a pin cushion. Gorgeous. Lovely. Then I've got garden birds. <laughs> Blue tit. This is a um, 
You can make a big one and two little ones from this. Bertie blue tit, the big doorstop and two pin cushions. Gorgeous. What, when were they made? Thirteenth of February. That was demoed first time round. You will need some stuffing and some weights as well. Beautiful. That's Bertie blue tit. Then we got. Uh, I was going to say Roger the Rab Rabbit, but I know it's not a rabbit. And it's Gordon the Goldfinch. There you go. Gordon the Goldfinch with instructions. All right, okay, lovely. Gorgeous. Right, next. So with Beth, I've got a couple of hers, yep. Yeah. Button over pouch, yep. Yeah. Sashko folded button over pouch, just in the red on this one. 19th of May, I was on with her to do this one. So you get your um, wadding, you get your fabric, your batik, you get your Sashko panel that she's drawn out herself. Oh, there it is. And your instructions and your Sashko thread. And you get your little um, elastic and your button for your loop. And you get your needle to do your Sashko with. £14.50. Cute, isn't it? Oh, and also, you get an extra bit in here because she didn't put enough in. So she had to rewrap little bits and put that in for you. You get lots for that. Lovely little gift that is, yeah. We did have it in two colourways, but the blue one's got the blue one's gone, I'm afraid. It's lovely. Oh, I've put it in upside down. There we go. Brilliant. I've got what? Oh, yeah. I was thinking I haven't, I haven't got one of those. Hexagon, table mat and coasters. Right, look. Oh, this is the lovely one. The love heart fabric and the blue swirl. £22.50. Oh, we're going crashing. Shouldn't do that. Nineteen pounds and ninety nine pence. Under twenty pounds. Lovely that it'll make this. So look, Hexy, 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 Hexy. So she cut these out for you specially. They're your templates. That's your fabric, that's your um, card, that's your fabric, that's your card. Then you get your lovely red fabric, your beautiful heart fabric, and your really amazing peacock green blue fabric. It is like Mark Fabric Marbling or Paper Marbling thing. On the front of the albums, you mean? Yeah. Oh, how I went to a posh school. In the reception at school, they had those with all the different classes in. Anyway, there's the instructions. So once you've got the instructions, you can then make as many as you like. Beautiful. Cardboards. Uh, nineteen ninety nine. Make the most of that while you can. Found a fabulous price. Shouldn't be um, lower. 
Twenty-two fifty is where it should be. And if you go, if you do your own fabric, you can make it bigger, 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 as much as you like. Bigger, 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 as much as you like. Don't know why she's now singing Spice Girl songs, but there you go. Next. Message. Morning, John. Your book's just arrived. Go to make a coffee and enjoy a good read. Thank you from Sharon. Oh, thank you, Sharon. They should be all out by now, shouldn't they? Fits through the letterbox. Anyway. Alex Caroline mini sampler. She was in last week doing this with me, Anna Sanders. Now she's done spring. This is summer. Autumn is coming in July. And winter is coming in September. At 59, 9, 10. So in here... This is incredible, right? Because you get all the Liberty Lawn to do all the piecing, the found uh, piecing, uh, EPP and raw edge applique. You also get the cream cotton, which isn't lawn, for the backing uh, and the backing of that. Plus you get the, the fabric for the binding and the sashing as well. And the instructions, there's all your fabric. The instructions are phenomenal because it tells you out of each fabric, it's got the templates to cut all of those bits out. Uh, so you don't waste any fabric. 59.99, very, very popular. Ooh. There's so many blooming wires back here. Now I've not fallen, don't worry, I've not fallen. Next. Yeah, now this was from my birthday show, Sunday. Origami cushion. Now you have to watch it in. It was on the 19th of June. This is 19th of June. Gone. You can either make it bisque or new, or you can make it uh, square. So it has those lovely origami flowers in the middle. So this one here, you get half a metre of your rose, a fat quarter of your apple green, and a fat quarter of your floral. 1999. Yeah. <laughs> 1999. Gorgeous. Watch the demo at 11 o'clock on 19th of June. Just gone. And you see Victoria Carrington, how you make those incredible little flower origamis in the middle. <laughs> at 19.99 gorgeous colours aren't they now the Victoria Carrington now this this is incredible right you can make the quilt which is 50 inches square uh, you can make the la one large cushion two small cushions the large cushion is 20 inches the two small cushions are 12 inches there's enough fabric to make all of it apart from the backing, the backing of the quilt. The rest of it is all included in there. Have we got a picture of the cushion that she made from this kit, please? No, no, oh, she had it here. Charlie took a picture of it. Anyway. You get two metres of your rows. You get a metre and a half of your marine. And then you get... How are you supposed to know what it finishes with that? We haven't kept the photo. I'm getting angry now. Why aren't we keeping photos? I don't understand. 59.99. A Victorian counter. It was on the set behind me. It made the most exquisite cushion out of that. At fifty nine ninety nine. They were beautiful. They looked so it looked so gorgeous. 
Go on, actually, what you can do is go to YouTube for Sunday and it's on the shelf behind me. So, not you, Hannah, I'm telling people at home. It's on the shelf behind me. It's a be makes the most exquisite, most exquisite uh, design. It's beautiful. At 59.99. But in that, for that 59.99, you make a 50 inch uh, square quilt, a 20 inch square cushion with the backing. The backing is included. The two 12 inch cushions, the backing is included and all the binding. The only thing you need to supply is 50, uh, well, your piece of um, fabric to back the quilt with and wadding. 59.99. You might not be able to see it because the balloons, maybe. Oh, Louise just got a book. Oh, Louise. Oh, send me, send me a private message, Louise. I'll get a photo to you. They didn't put a photo in Louise's book. It's not inside, Louise. It's not inside the book. Oh, yeah, that'd be good idea. If you, want to, if you don't know how to watch the show back on Sunday, what you can do... You don't have to go to YouTube, you go to our website, you go to TV Guide. Go to TV Guide, right? Then what, at the top of the page, you can go back a week. So Sunday the 19th is there. Then you can click on whichever one you want. There it is, the new Bold Blooms Quilt Cushion. And then you can start on it. And I just wonder if there's me. It's behind me, not Victoria. Anyway, there, there it is, there it all is. That's the one she sampled. Oh, no, that's the one I did, wasn't it? She sampled a different one. Anyway, anyway. Oh, there it is, behind, behind Cat's balloon. Oh, look, that shirt didn't look sparkly, did it? People kept saying, why are you wearing a boring shirt on your birthday? It was covered in gemstones. Anyway, that's how you can go and see it. That's how you can go and see it. So you don't have to log into YouTube or anything like that. Anything from the last seven days is available on the website. That's thick. Yep, you are loved. Yep. Moda, you little one. Um, I wonder why they've called it you little one then. It's so cute, isn't it, this? Oh, this is a brand new one. Have we got this one open? No, okay. So, it's called Be You Little One. So that's three different titles we've had. You Are Loved, Be You Little One, and this one is just You Little One. <laughs> There's your instructions. When was this done? Oh, we don't think it's been demoed. Sixth of June. Okay, what are you saying? Susie Duncan. Did Susie Duncan did it. Susie Duncan did it. On the sixth, apparently six of the six. Anyway, let's. I'll open that. Oh, look at these gorgeous fabrics. So where's that then? That's just usually your borders. Look in your hearts. Then you got your pink gingham. That makes your hearts. Then you've got your, oh look, your wood grain. That must looks like your binding. Check, I'm just saying what I think. Just check. Then you've got your beige wood grain. But look! Raccoon, fox, reindeer, rabbit, hedgehog. Now, you know no hedgehogs have moved into my hedgehog hotel. And I said, that's because we don't have hedgehogs in my village. Well, there was a squashed one on the road this morning. If he'd moved into my house. Anyway. So, the, oh, look, and then we've got them all in the green as well. Then we've got the sprig fabric. Blimey, there's a lot of fabric in here. Green gingham and your plain cream. But I think this is la pièce de résistance. Look. Look at these. There will be the centres of your blocks. Be kind, be wise, be yourself. Oh, I think all these. Hang on, let's look at this. Be wise, be kind, be yourself, be clever, be brave, be curious. You are cherished. Oh, I love that. 
I don't know if I don't know if it's for child. You see, I, somebody said it was for a child, but I don't think it's. Oh, it's a baby small lap quilt, forty-six by fifty-nine inches. It's by Effie's Woods. The fabric. Oh, I think that's lovely, isn't it? Be wise. There's the finished thing. Just look at this fabric, look, be wise, be kind, be yourself, be clever, be brave. These are all lovely affirmations to a, to a child as they're growing up, isn't it? Oh, Hannah's mum said to her when she went out when she was little, don't be you straight away. I'm down to single figures, down to single figures. You see, sometimes... I'm not saying about Hannah's mum because she, uh, but you know what I mean. It's kind of like um, sometimes things that our parents say to us can stay. You must remember because they can stay with you forever, can't they? I can remember my mum saying things to me or things happened to me when I was like, yeah, tiny, tiny, and they're still, they still niggle, they still niggle every now and then. So, anyway, who am I telling you what to do? Who am I telling you what to do? But you just remember, you know, they do stay. Oh no. Anyway, that goes in there. Goes in there, in there, in there, in there. That's beautiful. Single figures in that now, though. Single figures. Six now. Six now. I'm not surprised. It's beautiful. How much is it? 89.99. Split payment. Split. Why do I that one's on split pay? 44.99. No, it's from good. I mean, it's brilliant. It's brilliant to have it split pay. No, anyway, it's lovely. Keep going through for that. I, I think that's adorable, and the colours are lovely. Oh yep. Yeah. This quilt. Now we had issues with this at the weekend. Not with this. Not with this. But we had. On, on Saturday, when I was on with Hannah, sold out, right? There were enough people in the baskets for it to just take her out. Then we came in on the Sunday and Kat said, oh, there's still quite a few of those um, quilts left. I said, there can't be. Sold out, we had more than enough people in baskets. Anyway, it was that thing where it's putting, where it's like a lady messaged in going, um, I've just logged on, John, and I've got that pink king and prawns in my basket and I never even watched yesterday, so I don't know how it got there. If that happens to you, do not worry because you won't be charged for it. It's only when you check it. It's only when you check. It's only when Hannah's on. It's only ever when Hannah's on. No, no, because uh, oh no, it was only with Hannah. Oh, don't touch that camera, Ollie. I've got Ollie taking pictures. I'm waving to have your picture taken. Right, this is gorgeous. This quilt. Look at it. Look at it. Look at it. Right, I'll just open a small section of it so you can see it. Delphine. Um, demoed it on Saturday at 11 o'clock that's a photo is that a black and white photo <laughs> but look so all of these um you in the box I'll open it in a minute you get pink and Mick Jaguar fabric all of these diamonds are made out of those and then all of these diamonds you fussy cut from one fabric and then you make the little diamonds out of the geodes and the honeycombs to go around the outside now don't be thinking oh I couldn't be bothered with all those Y seams there aren't any you literally cut strip 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 sew them together and then cut it at 45 degrees like that then you sew them together and then when you actually sew the quilt together itself you sew them in straight lines even though they go they go diagonally across the quilt you actually sew them like that and then at the ends you cut off the triangles at the ends there to make it into a square the fabrics are exquisite you get over 11 meters of fabric in here 199.99 oh, been some... yeah oh look at all this gorgeous fabric so these geodes and hexes here are all your fabrics for the the little triangles and then underneath here oh no this one and this one are the ones you make your big pink di diamonds out of and then these are all the ones that you fussy cut 
for the centre of all your other diamonds. 199.99. Split pay 66.66. What is happening? Right, what happened was, Hannah said to me, how old are you, sir? And I said, jokingly, 21. So she took 21 pounds off. I'm wishing I'd said 62 now, but she wouldn't have taken 62 pounds off. Can the hedgehogs get into your garden? Yes, they can, Jan. I had holes cut in my fence, especially. Your shirt definitely looks sparkly on the day. Oh, thank you. Anyway, look. This is these the instructions. These are the instructions. You get the template, and then all the fabrics are in here, and then all the stripes. This is how you do it. You see, you cut your stripes. Take your 60 degree line. $178.99. Gorgeous, isn't it? It's absolutely stunning. No, Roy's not been down. Beautiful. I just put that away for it. We've got to start st stop storing these under here. I've just gone flying again. Jason, the enter now. Where's the black one? This one, this one was so popular. Yet yeah, on Sunday, so popular. The, we had it in black and we have it in green. Yeah, yeah, the green one flew, absolutely flew out, right? Because this is what you're making. Hang on. If I get the bag open, this is what you're making. Right. Look how gorgeous this is. Kaleidoscope quilt, right? Look at this. Now. Look. What, what? Already? Oh, okay, another £20 comes off that price. Don't remember that. But, 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 what you do, right, so first of all, 164 99 three split payments of 54 99 right? It's very, very clever the way that you cut this because, let me show you the fabric first. You've got this green fabric here, first of all, which you're going to cut certain sex squares out of and triangles out of. Then the rest of it is this enormous piece of fabric, look, and it's all the same. It's all the same fabric, right? But what you do is it's so clever. You get your, your the template in here. You cut your different triangles out at different places, right? So you cut out uh, uh, number. Well, they've each got different numbers, right? So you cut some out that way and some out that way. Right? But you cut them out over particular flowers. So what happens is you then sew them all back together again. Let me show you. You then sew them all back together again like this. In the triangles. The template's in here. So there you go. There's your template. That's all you're going to cut out. Right? And what you do is you literally cut some out that way with the orange flower. Some out that way. Some out that way. And then... You, and then you piece them all together. So if you see here, that one there makes that one there. So you cut all of those out like that. So you've got all of your pale background around the edge. And then these all go into the center. And then this, this one here, the orange and pink, oh, it's this one here. The orange and yellow one down here, that one gets cut like, where do I have to it? Like that way. It's just so clever the way it happens because it's just one fabric and there's a huge amount of fabric in here. We get 11 metres of it. So there must be nine, I think there's nine and a half metres of this. Just fantastic, isn't it? Now, there is a black one as well that looks like this. We haven't got it today, but please go and look on the web for that. No, 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 but there's a black one available on the website. But the green one flew out. On Sunday, flew out. There's only a few left, aren't there, Han? Yes, she says. Yes. I love it. 
And, uh, and, you know, normally I would always go for that dark background version. Right? I love this version. I think it's stunning. But look, look at that. You just literally, for the border, you just cut these out for your border. Oh, fantastic. Halcyon Kaleidoscope Quilt by Jason Yenta. And also, if you look at the background here, look at the background of this fabric here. It's got all swirls and dials and kaleidoscopes all printed in it as well. I can't hear you, Hannah, Bruce. Go, uh, Bruce, shh, 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 shh. Can, Hannah, what are you trying to say? Oh, sorry. I hope that can. Can you hear what she's saying? Right, sorry, Hannah. Okay, this makes no, no, no sense at all. Let's have a look. Oh, I remember. Whoopi John, hope you come from last night's Whoopi. Love your new nutter, Karen. Right, okay. So I, was, I stayed up late last night to watch um, Love Island because I thought we were going to find out who got voted off. And it got right to the end and they went, bing, the person voted off is... And then it went, I thought, I've just sat up for an hour waiting for that. Anyway, in the meantime, I got this very strange text message going, oh, that makes me sad. I'm, oh, she was watching Long Lost Fab. Wasn't meant for me. She sent it to the wrong John, right? And so I was like, and then she suddenly realised, and in the message, she went, I'm only talking to TV's famous John Scott at the same time as talking to you. And I was like, no, so she took, so, so she, she can't do two conversations at once. I just went, you're a nutter. You're a nutter, you are. So there. Anyway, her husband said he was going to have me arrested for chattering or something like I can't remember what it was now. <laughs> He's going to have me arrested because um, uh, I can't remember what it was. Chattering. I can't remember now. Anyway, should we move on? Oh, yeah, the tulips. Now, they're the same ones on here, but they're plain coloured. The ones I've got in my box are plain coloured. They're not these colours. They're plain colours. Okay. Okay. 1999. Uh, so Alison Marion's Vivid Plains Fabric Tulip Kits. I think we ought to do the Buddha kit first though. Oh, is it already gone? It's already gone, that's it. Okay. Yeah. Uh, right, these are vivid plain colours. These, 1999. Gorgeous. I hope Alison Marion comes back soon. I know she's busy looking after her dad and everything, but she well, not looking after him, but being with him sort of thing. I hope she comes back soon. Right now, I haven't got them on the desk here, I'll show you a picture, because back in stock, which one are you going to first? Sewing machine, brother sewing machine back in stock. Now you will see Stuart doing a demo on this tomorrow. I think it might be 12 o'clock tomorrow. I think it's 12 o'clock that he's doing it tomorrow. 3 99 split pay of 133.33. 250 stitches, three alphabets in capital letters, and um, three year warranty. Comes from us, not brother. Uh, and I've got them back in stock and you'll see Stuart demoing it sometime tomorrow. And the embroidery machine. Uh, now, it's a four inch embroidery space. There are 40, 45 or 25. 45 Disney, 45 inbuilt Disney designs. You can make those to gift, but you cannot sell them. But all the other designs in there, you can sell. It's got a USB stick, so you can uh, put your own in. And you can, if you've got, what was it you said you can design your own? Software to design your own embroidery patterns as well. Look at the price, £599. Split pay, three split pays of £199.66. I know, brilliant, isn't it? Absolutely brilliant. Uh, that also will be demoed by Stuart tomorrow. Oh yeah, I know Michelle. I know they've done it, Michelle, on purpose. <laughs> but I just thought, I was, how stupid am I staying up late? When I knew they were going to do that all along. 
I knew they were going to do it. Anyway, we're going for a break now. I know it's a bit early. We're going for a break now. I'm sorry if you've set your videos on. Uh, you'll still see the rest of the hour. I'll see you in about four minutes from now. Right. Why not get them a gift card? You can buy Sewing Street and Yarn Lane gift cards loaded up with anything from £10 to £500. Shop our gift cards online at www.sewingstreet.com or www.yarnlane.com or purchase them via our UK call centre on 0800 001 4433. Have you heard about all the different ways you can shop on Sewing Street? You can shop on our website, sewingstreet.com, and you can also order by phone by calling our friendly UK customer service team. Just call 0800 001 4433. And don't forget about the Sewing Street app. Here you can shop all of the Sewing Street products as well as watch the live shows from anywhere. You can download the app onto your smartphone or your tablet by simply searching Sewing Street in your app store. And one final thing, no matter how many times you check out on Sewing Street in one day, you will only pay one postage and packaging. Happy shopping! If you're a Sewing Street or Yarn Lane customer, no matter how many times you check out in one day, you will only pay one postage and packaging. So don't wait to add the item you want to your basket and check out. You will only pay one PMP even if you check out multiple times in one day. Missed the live show? Don't worry, we recorded it for you. Never miss out on your favourite presenters, guests and makes ever again. Head on over to our YouTube pages to watch back the day's live show and enjoy your favourite demos over and over again. We also have lots of great content exclusive to our YouTube pages, such as product demonstrations, troubleshooting videos, and so much more. Subscribe and turn on the bell notification so you never miss a show or video ever again. Have you heard about Yarn Lane, a TV show dedicated to knitting, crochet, and all things yarn? bringing you demonstrations from our expert guests as well as the latest tools. And find out what's coming up on the show by following us on Facebook and Instagram. Subscribe to our email newsletter or visit the programme guide on our website at www.yarnlane.com are you a fan of Sewing Street and Yarn Lane? Why not join our growing Facebook fans pages? Just search Sewing Street Fans and Yarn Lane TV Fans on Facebook and click Join Group. It's that simple. Never miss out on the latest news and updates from our presenters and guest designers, special offers and plenty of chat with your fellow fans. Share photos of your mates, ask for advice, interact with your favourite guests and presenters and be a part of the ever-growing sewing and yarn community. See you there. Have you heard about all the different ways you can shop on Sewing Street? You can shop on our website, sewingstreet.com, and you can also order by phone by calling our friendly UK customer service team. Just call 0800 001 4433. And don't forget about the Sewing Street app. Here you can shop all of the Sewing Street products as well as watch the live shows from anywhere. You can download the app onto your smartphone or your tablet by simply searching Sewing Street in your app store. And one final thing, no matter how many times you check out on Sewing Street in one day, you will only pay one postage and packaging. Happy shopping. Stuck for ideas for the perfect gift? Why not get them a gift card? You can buy Sewing Street and Yarn Lane gift cards loaded up with anything from £10 to £500. 
Shop our gift cards online at www.sewingstreet.com or www.yarnlane.com or purchase them via our UK call centre on 0800 001 4433. Missed the live show? Don't worry, we recorded it for you. Never miss out on your favourite presenters, guests and makes ever again. Head on over to our YouTube pages to watch back the day's live show and enjoy your favourite demos over and over again. We also have lots of great content exclusive to our YouTube pages, such as product demonstrations, troubleshooting videos, and so much more. Subscribe and turn on the bell notification so you never miss a show or video ever again. Have you heard about Yarn Lane, a TV show dedicated to knitting, crochet, and all things yarn? bringing you demonstrations from our expert guests as well as the latest tools. And find out what's coming up on the show by following us on Facebook and Instagram. Subscribe to our email newsletter or visit the programme guide on our website at www.yarnlane.com. Stuck for ideas for the perfect gift? Why not get them a gift card? You can buy Sewing Street and Yarn Lane gift cards loaded up with anything from £10 to £500. Shop our gift cards online at www.sewingstreet.com or www.yarnlane.com or purchase them via our UK call centre on 0800 001 4433. Miss the live show? Don't worry, we recorded it for you. Never miss out on your favourite presenters, guests and makes ever again. Head on over to our YouTube pages to watch back the day's live show and enjoy your favourite demos over and over again. We also have lots of great content exclusive to our YouTube pages, such as product demonstrations, troubleshooting videos and so much more. Subscribe and turn on the bell notification so you never miss a show or video ever again. Join us for an amazing week of early bird specials. From Monday the 20th of June, we're bringing you some fantastic bargains with bigger quantities and better prices. Join us every day this week from 8am so you don't miss these special deals. Becky Swan is back, Becky Swan is back, and that's what we're doing this time, we're doing little bags. Yeah, little bags. Little bags, little bags, little bags, but these are gorgeous, so it's a bundle. You can buy all of these together, right? So you get this one first. This is the Wash Bag Wonders in three different sizes. You get the Box Style Bag in three different sizes. And you get the Perfect Pouches in three different sizes. So what you're doing is you're buying all three, but you get one for free. So you pay for those two, you get that one for that one, whichever way around. But you pay for two, you get one free. All the dies for your Gemini machine are in the packet there. Becky's going to show you how to make them. She's going to be doing the this one. And then also all the dies are in there for all the different sizes, for the three different sizes of the three different designs. For $59.98, you are getting one for free. Right, before we go to Becky, I'm going to go through other things that you might want to buy because there's some gorgeous hardware here. So, first, rose gold, rose gold, rose gold. So, already going on pre-order. So, you're, you're buying the swivel clip. Oh, what do they, they don't call them swivel clips, do they? Oh, yeah, swivel snap buckles. You are getting the bag feet. I'm presuming there's four in oh six six in there uh, you are getting 6d rings oh and a free gift you're getting a free little handmade sign now I'm not going to open any of these because I'm going to show you them in the next colorway in a second hang on there's two of those six of those six of those and two of those 
in each packet in each packet i'm not going to open them now because i want you to see how first of all how beautifully the package but secondly uh, how, how they come 12.97 that is 12.97 for all of that in the rose gold you are saving money there actually i will open one because you want to see what rose gold looks like don't you they're really Should beautiful be colours, aren't they? Over fifteen pounds. There we go. This one's already been opened. <gasps> look, 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 luscious, luscious, luscious. They are. We all need a bag making stash. Now these might not. Set, they, these aren't on your pattern today, are they? But they're on the other ones. I, yeah. So I'm, I'm going to be doing these these little pouches yeah. today. So yeah, they're not they're not the hardware that I'm going to be using, but they are on some of the other bags. Um, but you're going to be able to use these for all sorts of different oh, yeah, bags course, and bits and pieces that you might want to do. Lovely. So that, I'm just showing that so you can see what the rose gold is like, right? So that's that bundle. I'll put those away while Becky's talking. Right. We also have a rainbow. So you get the 60 rings. You get the two swivel um, clasps. You get the six feet and the two handmade signs there. Now, when we say rainbow, oh, I'll put this one away and it never to come out again. We mean rainbow. They're, they're almost fantastic. like petrol rainbow, well, aren't they're, they? Well, they're like that electromagnetic mm. when you get oil on water and things, aren't they? Very much Tula Pinkess, because Tula does scissors and everything like this, doesn't she? Look at these, right? Look, a lot of the bag designers are going to like these, aren't they? Look at those. They're exquisite. Let me move that way. Exquisite, aren't they? Absolutely exquisite. And you've got That's so many colours in there, it's going to go with so many different fabrics. Yeah, oh yeah, you know, definitely. A definitely. lot of K-Facet um, fabrics would really work well with those. Well, and, and Tula, because yeah. Tula loved them. Load, oh, look at these. Look at the colours there. 1697. So how much should these be? 2196 the rainbow one should be can i just say these are really these are they're not flimsy no, by any means are they because you know sometimes you get cheap bags and you you know you do have the hardware is a little bit suspect yeah, yeah, isn't it? a little yeah. bit bendy those are not gonna bend no matter the, how these, your no bag is. these are solid we have a good stock of them but they are actually flying out the door these absolutely flying do you want to see something else in the pink in the color then let's look at the feet of the bags I love the way they come in little cardboard boxes because obviously you can recycle them. No plastic. No. Recycle them. They're in tissue paper so you can recycle that. Oh, I can, oh, I can see these through the tissue. Look at these. Look at the bag feet. Imagine that you're not even going to see those. They're going to be on the bottom of your bag. But how good do you know what you could almost use those to decorate rather than mm. just use them as feet on yeah. the bottom of your bag couldn't you what are you saying Han oh big makeup bag like on glow up <laughs> be the fight it's a semi-final this week is it or is it a final no semi-final I think there's a brand that does makeup brushes in that kind of rainbow which oh, would work they? very well oh yeah. gorgeous mm. should we look at the handmade lay before we go on hang on Sorry, I'm self-indulging here. Oh, that's not that doesn't sound right. <laughs> Sorry, indulging myself. Right, look. Oh, look. Hang on a minute. There you go. It's got a bit of sellotape over it to just to. The D rings are one inch. The swivel clips are one inch. These are obviously just that big. 35 millimetres. Let me take the sellotape off this one so you can see. Oh, look. Gorgeous, aren't they? Aren't kind they? Of disco. Fantastic. Beautiful. Right, I'll just put all those to one side. I'll tidy those up in a second. Be careful on that because they're flying out. Absolutely flying out. We had a huge stock of those and a third of the stock's gone. Uh, I'm just going to talk about, because you're going to use the positioning mm -hmm. ruler, aren't oh, yeah. you, in this one? Positioning ruler. Saving 10% on this, I don't know which is the best way to do it that way. Saving 10% on this. You'll see that being used in a minute. Oh, we have two zips on a roll. 
Right, can I just tell you a quick story, right? So I was working at Crafters Companion when COVID hit, and Sarah said to me, because I was on on a Tuesday morning on Crafters Companion website, would you do a little show from home each week? And I said, yeah, of course, you can sell one of our items each week. And the first week, right, they sent me sips on a roll, and I was like, oh, honestly, what? I'm only on for 20 minutes. We did, I did like over £2,000 worth of these zips in 20 minutes because they're, they're so popular and so good. Right, we've got a bundle here and I'll explain what they are. Get them out in a minute, I'll show you what they are. We've got black, white and cream here. So you buy two, or you buy all three, but you get pay for two, get one for free. Yeah, people know what these are. Should be 23.97 in total. Now, let me just show you because, is it five metres? Five metres and ten sliders, that's right. I haven't forgotten. And what it is... Oh, quarter of the stock's gone on pre-order already. Got it, got it, got it, got it. Right, so look. This way, you'd never have to go to the shop and go, oh, I need a ten-inch dip and a three-inch dip and a seven-inch dip, whatever. You literally... What happens is there's a, little, there's a little hole you can cut in the box there. So the zip actually comes out of there. You don't need to take it out like I have done. But look. It's on a roll inside, right? You get five meters worth of zip and you get 10 headers, 10 sliders. So what you do is if you think in the morning, oh, I'm gonna make a bag, I need an eight inch zip, right? You just move the sliders that way, because don't forget, you don't want to cut those off. I'll be with you in a second, caller. <laughs> There's so many of them, aren't there? Right, so look, so you need one on there. You need one on there, so what you do is you think, right, I want an eight inch zip. You measure your eight inches, you cut it off. Make sure that the one slider, one header is on where you want and the others are all out of the way. And then tomorrow, you might want a three inch zip. So you just wind, push that down to there, you cut your three inch zip and it's just fantastic. You, excuse me, you never ever waste any zip whatsoever. And you get five meters and 10 headers, right? white black and that was the lovely cream that you saw there half the stock's gone oh i was like my, i'm back in my dining room in october. when went when march <laughs> march the 30th two years ago 1598 yeah yeah you can buy them singly but you don't get that deal at all have we got them on are they on today's um they're on pre-order if you want them singly they're on pre-order if you'd like to get them singly but we like to bring you a good deal as well Fifteen ninety-eight. You get you get uh, get one for free, aren't you? Get one for free. Right. Anything else you want to show before we start Becky off? Yeah. Let's get you going. Let's get you going. It's very busy on checkout. Checkout on aisle four, is it? <laughs> very busy on checkout on aisle four. Did Wild you, in the aisle. Did aisles. you ever work in a supermarket? No, I worked on a fruit and veg stall in oh, Chester did you? Market. I yeah. can see you. you know. Shelders fruit and veg stall, and you started off on potatoes and carrots and worked your way up to cheese, eggs, and chickens. Oh, and oh. chickens. Yeah, we saw chickens. And live chickens. No, 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 they oh, weren't live. Say, no, they weren't live. <laughs> That'd oh, be a lot to handle, wouldn't it? Oh, don't we're bad <laughs> enough as well. Anyway, so what are you going to show? Are oh, you doing the, the makeup? I, I thought bag, I'd show you what the bags look like and um, made up because it's always very difficult to see from the packaging. Um, so the first one I was going to show you is this one here. So these are the wash bag wonders. So as John was saying, you get three different sizes. Um, these are great coming up for you know, Christmas and birthdays and things like that. Making a set of bags as a little gift, or you can make these and then sell them at craft fairs. They've got some great little pockets and zip places here. So you've got ni lots of nice space in this one. Perfect for people. Go Hopefully lots of people will be going on holiday soon. Um, these, are, these, are gonna, these are gonna be absolutely great for you. It's almost like I, I planned that, that you were gonna be going away. And you've also got these little zip pockets in here as well. So you, we've, got, we've thought about all these different um, things you can do, different sizes. So a great opportunity to make all three and give them away as a little gift. So that is your wash bag wonders. Then we've got perfect pouches, which again are almost like makeup bags. Um, if they've got that kind of look to them. But, you know, you could use these as little wallets, little you know, purses, that kind of thing. Great when you're going in, um, or going on holiday, you know, you're on the, on the beach, little bag to pop your sun creams and bits and pieces in. And these have got a very nice sort of, um, bo bo they've got a nice flat bottom, oh, as it were. Well. And then, again, little, little zip pockets um, down the sides here as well. Um, so you've got plenty of places to pop all your bits and pieces. So those are your wash bag wonders. And these are your box style bags. 
So these, I think, I feel are really great for anyone going to going to a festival. Jack going Reed's somewhere like that. Now. Yep. Oh. Going to one of those kind of a big festival somewhere where you want a little bag. Um, you want to um, be able to hold all your bits and pieces in them. This is the largest one. Um, so this is the large one. Again, you've got little zip pockets here and there. Um, you've got lots of um, space inside them. Um, you can open, we've just got some bubble wrap in there, but you could always no, put some. What um, you need to festival, isn't I know. Bubble wrap. Well, you never know. It keeps you warm. Yeah. It might be chilly on one of these festivals. Um, but this little one, I think you could fit. You could fit a mini packet of Pringles in there. A oh, press. That, that, that's kind of thing. Can you get little, ni nibbles yeah, on the bus? Little tiny bag, really lovely little bag for for a child. Um, and then you've got all your hardware on here. So these ones we've just used D rings on, but the larger bags, so the large one and the medium, we've used the swivel hooks on there as well. Brilliant. So really, really nice um, little bags for you to do. Now, on for last week, when Rebecca Reed was in on Saturday, she nicked one of the tote bags, you know, the birthday tote bags we had. I don't know where mine's gone, actually. Anyway, she said, when you go to... I don't need it, I don't need it, I can take it home later. Um, when you go to Glastonbury and you've got to queue up to go to the toilet, right? She's going with the tote bag over her neck with all her things in, right? This is big enough, right? If you're at Glastonbury, open this up, right? You've got room in there for your toilet roll your hand wipe, your hand sanitizer, your air freshener, all your bits and bobs that you might need when you go to powder your nose or anything like that in the little, because they'll only have those plastic cubicles, won't they? They won't have anything posh there, will they? And that's, if you could fit a fair amount in there, you're absolutely oh, right. Oh, no, no, yeah, this, yeah, this is the perfect yeah, size. Yeah. So this could be your toiletries bag. So yeah. you've then not, not got that embarrassing thing of going, oh, I've just got to go to the toilet, routine for your toilet roll and everything like that. It's all in there. Then you put it back in your tent, wherever you're staying in. Hannah needs this right now for all her hay fever. Because she said, she said this morning, <laughs> oh, I've just got to get my hay fever stuff out. Now, I'm lucky because Leanne, the breathing expert, sorted me out. Look, my hay fever's completely gone now. Um, so Hannah said, I've just got to get my hay out. She tipped her bag up like this, right? She went, there are my tissues, there's my inhaler, <laughs> there's my nasal spray, there's pill number one, there's pill number two, and eye drops, that was the other thing. If they're all in there, Hannah, nobody would know. No, I don't want a big bag to put it all in. That's perfect. And having that strap on there as well, yes. it makes it no, much more usable, doesn't it? Totally. So, yeah, really, really useful. So each one of these packs is going to have the three different sizes in there. Um, so if I show you, this is the, um, the perfect pouches. Um, so this is one I'm going to be using um, today. So you can see the three different um, sizes on here. Now, the larger one has two zip pockets on it. Um, and then the, the medium one has a one horizontal zip pocket and the smaller one doesn't have a zip pocket on there. But if you wanted to follow the directions, you could, of course, put multiple pockets on yeah, there if course, you wanted yeah. to. Um, so once again, these are our, um, our multimedia dies. So these are thicker and d deeper than ordinary dies. Again, they're not sharp. They're not going to hurt you. But these are something that you will need to have a Gemini or a die cutting machine um, to use. You won't be able to um, use them without. So you've got three different sizes here. Um, that make the actual um, bag bag body and then you've got one piece here which makes the pocket um, so you this a nice simple easy one to do how do you know which is which does it come with a guide behind yeah, because normally got, there's a there's you've a got a little booklet here which shows oh, you yeah, yeah, um, yeah, yeah. on here where you've got your different size panels and your your pocket it's the same size pocket for all of them but obviously if you wanted to make a if you did want to make a little pocket for the tiny one um you, you know you wouldn't you'd only be able to make you could probably fit a lipstick in there if you were going to be putting a, a little pocket in there but you could do and just cut that down yeah. and we also give you the details of the instructions about how much of everything you'll need and whether you need zips and that kind of thing so i'm using zips on the roll for this um and i'm going to be using um my um gemini with my um, fabric um, do, plates. do crafters companion have an angel policy are we allowed to make to buy yeah. Yep. No absolutely. problem with that. No problem at all. No okay, there all. you go. So I'm just thinking if you're doing a Christmas fair yeah. or a, a stand for your church or for your school or anything like that, yeah. no problem. And these would be great. I mean, you're saying about school. You know, we always struggle with um, you know, parents trying to work out what we can give to a teacher. You know, you could give a teacher one of these bags filled with some toiletries. You know, that's a really nice gift and it's and it's relatively inexpensive mm. in comparison to what you know you could I can't tell you what the kids in my class were not my last year at Garth have comp got for me. We used to steal cigarettes from the shop. <laughs> I didn't send them to order. 
You sound, you sound like a modern day Fagin. No, no, no. It's because the staff room, in those days, you're smoking. The staff room was like this glass building in the middle of the school, so all the kids could see in. And I'd just sit there by the, by the window, having a fag in the break and everything. And they suddenly, all the kids, I, I adored my non examination class kids, the naughty yeah. kids and everything. And they started going, What fags do you, what fags do you smoke, sir? And I'd say, Oh, John Player Blue. And they were like, Next day, there was a practice John. But, so I didn't, I told them off. I told them off. I don't, I don't imagine many children are going to be doing that now for no. the teachers, are they? No. Just a, a, I, th I think often a bottle of wine is the, the thing that well, they do. No, it was a long in. time ago, a long time ago, yeah. Right, go on So um, when, you, when you get down here, you'll see it, it gives you the details about how many of everything you need to cut. So whether you need to cut two out of your outer fabric, you're going to be using any wadding, you're going to be using any interfacing. Um, so we've given you all the instructions here. So it's very easy for you to see straight away whether you've got all the bits and pieces you need to make this. Um, and then we've given you step-by-step -step instructions um, throughout here. And also when you look um, on our website, you'll see that there's a, a video um, of me making these. So uh, uh, we've got a step by step videos, um, so we've made it quite simple for people. So to that's not follow. our uh, website, no. that's your Crafters Companion. That's right, website. yeah, that's Crafters Companion. So what I've done here is I've taken some fabric um, and I've just. Um, I've just cut some wadding and I've sprayed my, this is my um, our, our spray that I put on there. Um, so this is, um, you could use either one of these sprays. So we have our stick and stay, which is the um, permanent one. And we have the stick and spray, which is the temporary one. Um, so the, 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 the um, permanent one just needs some kind of heat on it to make it um, uh -huh. permanent. But I, I did, I'm, I'm sticking <coughs> to it because I've still got it. Um, put here and um, so I'm just going to put a little bit more of this um, stick and spray on here um, at the moment so I, all you need to do so you'd want to do this in a well ventilated room yeah with so, no ventilation here whatsoever Becky so, Swan uh, there uh, you are getting those they should be um, 16 pounds though 7.99 they are normally you get them for 14.38 if you buy the two together now when I spray them I don't know whether I do it the same way as everybody else I put my fabric onto my wadding um, without no without spray and I only fold up back half and then I spray one side and then spray the yeah, other yeah. and then obviously with the um, the permanent one you want to use some kind of heat on it so you just give it a quick iron but um, actually that that's fine with my pretend spray yeah um, that I've done on them um, so that's all you need to do here now what we want to do is we want to cut a piece of um, the bag so we want two of these out of the outer fabric and the wadding and two out of the lining. So I've already pre-cut some of the pieces. Um, but what we want to do is, you can see we've only got half of the bag here. Yeah. We want to put um, that on the fold. So I'm just going to fold that over. Now, I would so you're going to cut it with the wadding attached to it? Yeah, I oh, do, because wow. I find it easier. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, so I'm just going to put that all together. And I will use a bit of tape here. Ooh. Because I want to make sure the edge of that, um, that the, just the point of that um, die is just over the edge of my fabric uh -huh. and to make sure it's a proper cut. Okay. I'm trying to put it at a very slight angle. Um, it will make a bit of a bang as it goes down because we've got very straight sides and yeah. it's, it's quite a big guy to go on the um, on the border. Okay, so fabric plates. So we've got clear plate, fabric plate. These are the extra fabric yeah. plates that are in here. Oh, they go on the head. One and then red, the there. other um, fabric plate on top and the other um, clear plate on top of that. Dave and I machine, don't forget you have £100 worth of freebies with if you buy today. The Drunkard's Path and the Diamond um, Dies. Are you ready? Yeah, I'm ready. So, you know, you, I put mine on a uh, Lazy Susan. Oh, and spin it around? You spin it around, which is quite useful if you don't have a huge amount of space. So, you can see here that that's cut that out beautifully with the wadding there and it does mean it just it, it makes I feel it makes it a little bit easier I didn't quite get it to the very edge of that piece so I'm just going to trim that with my scissors but um, you can see it makes um, 
it makes it easy so you don't have to be trying to match up those pieces of fabric together. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So I do that with my lining um, and my um, interfacing if I was using interfacing. I, I've, not done, I've not used interfacing today so I don't right. think I really need it. Um, but obviously it depends on the, upon the kind of fabric that you're going to use. So that is one part of our, um, our bag. Now what we're going to use now is our positioning ruler. Oh. Now this is really useful. So I move these out of the way so you can see. This is particularly useful for, um, for bag making, but it's also really useful for um, dressmaking because you can then work out, perhaps you're going to be making a jacket and you want to work out where you're going to put your buttons. Um, because you've got a, a zero in the middle of the ruler and then you go out in one inch increments, it makes it nice and simple for you to put things oh. together. Mm. So it's just quite handy when you're, you're measuring um, bits and pieces to make sure everything's in the right place. Yeah, yeah. So for example, I know that that's my, my centre point because I've got my, um, what's that word called? Fold. Yeah. Uh, that's that's the word I'm looking for. So I can put. How that much did you drink on your birthday? I didn't have anything to drink oh. on my birthday because I was coming here last night, so I didn't have anything. So you spent your birthday evening on your own. I did. Oh. Yeah. Sad. Did they get you lovely presents though? The family. I went. No. Oh. No. So my husband bought me a, a box of my favourite chocolates that apparently he spent 25 minutes in the shop choosing, and he's chosen all dark chocolate. Oh, that I wrong? don't eat dark chocolate. <gasps> no! So he's eating my chocolates. Yeah, fine. Um, my daughter bought me a bottle of um, perfume yeah. and then I went shopping. I went and bought myself something. Oh, self-gifting is the yes, way to go. Yeah, yeah. yeah. So I, you know, I, did, I did well. I'm quite yeah, pleased about yeah, it. Good. So no, it's, it's not a problem. I'm just thinking these rulers would be good for marking darts if you're dressmaking patterns yeah. and things because yeah. you get your centre point you have to mark an inch either side or pleats or anything like yeah, that. Yeah, yeah, absolutely. It re it's really useful. I mean, it's, <coughs> it's such a simple little piece of kit, but it's actually really clever. Uh, you've, uh, you've got little holes in here as well. Um, so if I wanted to mark an inch below the, the, this line here, I've got a little dot I just pop my pen, my heat erasable pen into, um, and that goes in at one inch increments. So it's really, really useful for you to have. Now, on the instructions, um, it tells you to um, mark the, um, you want to mark it, um, three quarters of an inch um, below it's entirely up to you what you want to do and this is in order to make those little zip places uh -huh. so what we're going to do is we're going to use this is um, a pocket that I've already cut using the die um, so that's using this die for the pocket so I've just already cut that out okay. um, I want to make um, these kind of little um, zip zips down here Oh, these oh yeah, down yeah, here. yeah. Um, so um, this is what I'm going to use here. I'm, I'm just going to position my um, pocket in the right place. I want it around about here, and I'm going to use my ruler to mark where I want my zip to be. So I want it um, about three quarters of an inch from the edge. I'm just going to put a little dot there. Keep that all lined up. So I'm going to use my zips on a roll. So I want a, um, a zip on a roll, I want that four and a half, I want two of those four and a half inches um, long. So you can see I, I've used a lot of my zips on the roll, <laughs> but I've only got two, two pieces left. So just as John said, you just need to zip um, your pulls out of the way, so the pulls that you don't need, and then you would measure where you want your, your zip to be. So I want um, four and a half, so that's where I want to cut it. But this is brilliant because a lot of like haberdashery shops don't exist anymore. No. Like you go to John Lewis's, which used to be a whole floor in Oxford Street, is yeah. now under the escalator, you know. And also you get there and they might not have a four and a half inch one no. in the colour that you want. <coughs> Do you know what I mean? So it's ideal this because you can make completely and utterly bespoke zips for your project. I, I mean, I, I completely agree with you. I, I remember John Lewis being the place to go if yeah. we wanted to get any, you know, any fabric, or you know, then we would head off, off into Soho to yeah. go and get the rest of it. But it's a, it's it's really difficult now to yeah. get zips, and then the, you never get the right colour, you never get the right the, the the teeth are too big, you know. There's all these different options. So yeah. what I'm going to do now is I'm going to mark um, four inches. So I've got a four and a half inch zip here. So that's one, two, three, four, and then I'm going to mark I want um, half an inch there and half an inch there and I'm just going to mark that there and then what we would do now is I want to so you see my, my zip is a little bit bigger than that yeah. what I would do now is I would sew around here so all of this is in the instructions um, in the booklet I would sew around here um, and then I would cut 
um, a, a slit all the way through here down uh -huh. this line and then just to these little points down here and I, I tend to then trim this to get rid of all of my um, excess fabric um, and then you'll, you'll tuck your um, little um, pocket inside this little hole almost like a letterbox and then you're going to place your zip in there so you end up with a nice finish to your zip yeah exactly so i'm going to give it a bit of a pin and then i'm going to quickly sew around that okay so you can see what that looks like just looking for my pins I can never find my pins too much in my there's loads too much in, in my bag. craft bag that's what the problem is so hopefully you can see where I've put that, that line. It hasn't yeah, 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 out quite so clearly. Yeah. So I'm just using my heat erasable pens here. There we go, like that. So I'm just going to sew all the way around the outside here. Uh huh. My, my foot on. Yeah, yeah, you get all the instructions, not just left hand no. hanging. And also, if, you, if there's something you don't understand, go to the Crafters Companion website, look under the videos, and you'll see um, Becky making it, making it. And, you know, there's, um, in fact, we had, we had a, a customer the other day who was having some issues with one of her products. Um, she just couldn't get it to work the way she wanted it to. And she's spoken to so customer services were, were helping her. But actually, she, came, she reached out to me through Facebook. Um, and I'm, I'm very happy to help people. So if anyone ever gets confused, you know, we do have um, you know, a big team of people that can help. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, so you're, you're never, you're never going to be left on your own, unless you want to be. <laughs> Okay, so I'm just stitching around yeah, leave that, me alone. That, that, little, um, that little rectangle that we've got here. Okay. And then down here. So it looks a bit strange. It looks like you're doing everything backwards here um, because you're sort of sewing your pocket onto the, the front or the outside of your, um, your, little, um, your little pouch, your little bag. And so I'll just trim those out of the way. And so what I'm going to do now is I'm going to take my rotary cutter. Rotary cutter. Comes with three replacement blades. Can make it left-handed or right-handed. 45 millimeter. So I just cut in the center there and then I'm cutting into the corners so I've not cut all the way to the end I've left that little edge uh -huh. um, free so I'm just cutting into those corners here um, now I find that I, I need to trim around the edge here right. um, it depends on the fabric it depends on the wadding you're using as well and um, whether you need to trim it because um, you want to sort of reduce that bulk around the pocket um, the pocket the zip pocket so we're just trimming around here like that and then we're going to trim that little um, edge, little triangle away as well, like so. Okay. Now what we're going to do is we're going to put this pocket through. So we post this pocket through this hole here. And this is the time where you, you want to have your, your um, iron on uh -huh. because you want to iron everything. Oh, that's the point. But I'm not yeah. going to, um, I'm not going to iron it today. I'm just going to show you how it looks. Yep, yep. So we're just going to pull this all round. I'm just going to do a little bit of a finger press around here. So you've uh -huh. created this letterbox effectively, yeah, yeah, this yeah, yeah, shape yeah. here. Yeah. Um, and you can see by using that um, the contrasting fabric, you get the little bit of a, a, a peak of that coming through, which looks quite nice. Yep. Then what we're going to do is we're going to pop the zip here and then we'll stitch all the way around the outside and that creates your little pocket. Uh -huh. um, once we've done that, we're then we're going to fold this up and we're going to stitch down here, just on the actual, so we'll pull this away, just on the actual pocket and around the top. Okay. But I've done one already. Okay, perfect. To show you what that looks like. So you can see that's how it looks. It would look. So you've got these two little pockets on either side right. um, with the zips, and then we've just sewn around the edge. So we've created these little mini, mini places for you to. Oh, that one's a bit sticky. That that zip. Let's try this one. There you go. So you've got these little mini pockets down here uh -huh. um, with this contrasting fabric, which looks quite cool. So what we're going to do is we're going to put the bag um, together. So you do this in the same way for your your bag. Um, your outer bag as well as you, your lining. So we would want to put right sides together. Uh -huh. And then we're going to sew 
down this side here. No, we're not. We're going to do the zip first. What am I thinking of? Do Don't I? want to do that yet. Got, I've, I've, gone, ahead done of, I've gone ahead of myself. I've, yeah. done, I've done those two zips. That's what's confusing me. Um, so I've already cut um, a longer piece, a longer zip. So this one is, I'll just check the sizing. This is 12 and a quarter um, inches, this zip. And I've just put little tabs at the very end um, of some fabric um, that matches. Or uh -huh. you can do some uh, contrasting fabric. Um, and what we're going to do is we're going to layer it up with the um, lining. So this is our lining fabric um, that we've got here. So again, done in exactly the same way as the outer fabric in that we folded it over and then we've used that die um, that goes over the top of it just to um, using that fold um, like so. Um, so I haven't used any interfacing on here because um, I didn't feel it really needed no, to. No, no, no. Um, because it's got quite a lot of... Um, it's, it, you don't really need interfacing in, in a lining when you've got quite a rigid outer mm -hmm. a bag already. Um, so we're going to be um, sort of sandwiching everything together. So we're going to start with our piece like this, and we're going to put right sides together. So right sides together would be like that. So I'm just lining that all up, and then I'm going to put my lining on here. Now the lining I've chosen, it doesn't really matter which way round you go. Well, I think it makes it nice <coughs> and easy. It's batik, isn't it? Yeah. I quite like that orange and the, the turquoise together. Uh -huh. Look quite nice. Um, so I'll use some clips if I can find some. Okay. Got yeah, everything in that bag. Haven't I you? have. So just some um, quilting clips around the outside. So what I'm doing is I'm sandwiching my outer piece of um, my bag, my zip, and my lining fabric all together. And I'm going to clip that all together here. And we're going to do the same with the other side. So we've got to have the zip up at the top of the bag. Okay. Have you ever been to Glastonbury, John? No. Would you ever go? Only if I was in a very posh Winnebago <laughs> and Shirley Bassey was playing. Oh, okay. It's um, Diana Ross this year, I it think. It is, isn't yeah. It? Uh, the thing is, I was just thought of it as like one stage in a field, but apparently it's like a whole vi it's a whole town. It's massive. To walk from one side to the other takes a good day to walk from one side to the other. It's enormous. No, oh, a good day? Well, yeah, because really? that, that's what Craig, Craig Charles was saying. Wow. I had no idea it was that, that much. That's yeah. huge. I've never been. I've never wanted to go, actually. Well, the shops and everything. And there's a, there's a craft field where you can go and learn to make things. Mandy Shaw's there. Oh, really? Teaching classes in a field and oh, everything. Oh, I didn't know that. Yeah. That's very interesting. Well, I always wondered how they had, you know, they said, oh, such as on the pyramid stage and such. They're, they're vast. They're miles, of, not miles, but they're, well, yeah, miles apart from each other. So you have to plan, really plan where you're going to be and you're where you're going to find. Is. You're never going to find your friends if you no, lose them, no. are you? Move my zip down a little bit. So I'm using my zipper foot, but I should have moved my zip along a little bit anyway. Okay. Yeah, while you're while you're stitching that, the three bund the bundle of the three different bags. Oh, the metalware. Sorry, the metalware. Sorry, 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 sorry. sorry. Yeah. Rainbow bundle first, so you get your two swivel clips, your six feet, your six D rings, and a free gift of two handmade, two handmade signs. Sixteen ninety seven should be what twenty two pounds. You say this one? Nice, sturdy, high quality wear. No, uh, no, no plastics, they're all in boxes and tissue papers. You can recycle all of that. Twenty one ninety six. that was four P off. Fantastic. Then we've got them in rose gold. So you get six D rings, two swivel clips, six feet, and two handmade signs. Twelve ninety seven should be sixteen ninety six. Fabulous. I'm going to just redo the dies while I'm here. Three dies, three sets of dies. So you've got here, you've got the perfect pouch, three different sizes. 
You are. You've got the wash bag wonders, three different sizes, and you've got the box style bags, three different sizes. You buy them, you're paying for two, you're getting one for free. 59.98. So I'm, I've now stitched that Whoa. in there. It's quite noisy, my machine. And That's I'm just, her own machine. She's not making one of mine, don't worry. Um, it, it has had a bit of a hammering lately. And I'm now just top stitching um, over that part there. Right. So just to finish it off. And it just makes sure that it keeps all of the fabric out of the teeth of your, your, your zip. Of course. Yeah. You don't want that. I think that machine is screaming, please get me serviced. Well, do you know, this is my mum's machine because mine needs a service and I hadn't um, got round to um, uh, getting it done and now they both need doing Oh, no. Now. So I think I'm, I might be in the market for a new machine. Yes. We've had this conversation already, yep. haven't we? <laughs> so I've just stitched that piece on there. So, and we're going to do exactly the same thing with the other side. So we've got the... Um, fabric here so this is the outer piece of the fabric we're going to put the zip da facing down so we've got right sides together so right side of the zip right side of the outer fabric and then the lining fabric over the top okay. here and then we're just going to pin it together and then sew that um, together to make the the zip part of the bag so again like I said very simple um, for you to do and these were I think these are going to make great gifts um, you know we'll Weddings, you know, for the bride, you know, and bridesmaids making yeah. these, you know, actually with the um, all that lovely um, hardware and the, the rainbow would look really nice with white bags or green oh, yeah. bags, wouldn't it? Or the rose gold, of course. Um, but you know, you can pick out all those different colours with those rainbow um, colours. Or you can make one for each guest with their name embroidered on it and it could be their table gift. Wow, I think you'd have to start now, if, even if you get married next year, wouldn't you? Yeah, you'd be doing yeah. That. <laughs> that sounds like quite a nice idea. Yeah. I hope my niece isn't watching this because um, I'm oh, helping... Oh, you're organising her wedding? I am. She'll say, oh, I like that idea. And when is it? Uh, next... Um, oh, you've got ages. No, 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 no. I've got plen I haven't got plenty of time. Trouble is, if somebody drops out, and then you get a replacement and they've got they've got a little pouch with someone else's name on I it. I think you just have to say and if there are any replacements they've got to have the same name as a person that's yeah. not, no longer there, don't you? I'm yeah. sorry, I can only have a friend called Sarah. Yeah. <laughs> but, um, yeah, there's lots there's lots to organise with a wedding. I'd sort of forgotten about it. Yeah. Got oh, yeah, you'll be fine. You have to book everything so far in advance yeah. now, don't you? The venues and the photographers and everything like that. We had, um, we had somebody from the studio um, to help set up the tables and um, to decorate them because we wanted, I wanted something very specific with my decoration. And um, she then started doing um, sort of stylist work um, and she, she got a, um, a big celebrity wedding off the back of some photographs from my wedding. Oh, wow. And it was um, Katie Price and Peter Andre's wedding. Oh, really? So, and, and I had a dress that was, uh, would have rivaled Katie Price's no. dress. It was enormous. I mean, absolutely enormous. As I went down the aisle, it knocked down the chairs. It no. was that big. Yeah. And in fact, when I went to a wedding at the same, the same church the next year. You the, didn't wear your wedding dress. No, no, no. But I, I was a bridesmaid the next time. And the vicar said, oh, do you know, last year we had a, a, a bride. Oh, the no. most enormous dress. And I was like, it was me. Oh, I, I, <laughs> embarrassing but there you go uh, you know you've got to you've got to be like a princess did you arrive in a glass globe then like I Katie Price did no I didn't I didn't I, I, I arrived in a in a normal well a nice car carriage um, a car yeah. yeah not a carriage yeah um, so yeah apologise for my noisy machine um, but we're just going to stitch along here so I'm just going over um, top stitching here it does sound like it needs a service, doesn't it? It does. And a new needle, I think. Shall I just recap zips on a roll while you're doing that? Very few zips on a roll left now. Deal is you buy, t uh, you buy two, you get one for free. Five metres of zip, ten sliders on in each box. £15.98. Gorgeous. Right, okay, back to Becky. 
Right, so I've stitched um, all of that now, and now what I want to do is I want to take the two outer pieces of my bag and the two lining pieces. But before I do that, I'm just going to unzip Open the it. Zip. Yeah. Like that. So we've got this here. Now we're going to sew all the way around apart from a gap here and we're not going to do these little corners um, right. yet so we're going to do those afterwards so it's just a case of matching everything up and it should all match up perfectly because you've used the gem knife uh -huh. because you've cut it all um, using um, you know those dies it should all match up perfectly um, and, and I think this is why one of the reasons I find um, adhering the wadding to the the fabric and then cutting it out seems to be a little bit better because everything yeah. then matches up a little bit easier so just stitching around here so just this is where your, your clips come into their own of course yeah <coughs> okay i'm gonna go all the way around here so i did go to one festival oh yeah um and actually i am going to a festival this year but it is a, it's only a day Oh, and, it, and it's literally around the corner. It's at Gunnersbury. Oh, is it? Yeah. So it's going to be nice and it's easy to get home. It's like yeah. a twenty-minute, a twenty-minute stagger um, home, and, um, and and I don't have to I don't have to camp. No. Um, and once you get in, um, all the obviously all the music is included, but all the food and drink is included. Crikey. So yeah. Yeah. So um, I I have When's to. When's that then? Um, 9th of July. Oh. So it's quite exciting, but you you buy your ticket and you don't know who's going to be there. You don't know who the lineup is. Okay. So it's always a little bit of a gamble. But I always sort of think, well, you it's know, a day out. yeah, it's a day out, and you know, I can fill my fill my boots with champagne and nice you know, food. nice food. So um, it doesn't really matter who's performing. No. So. Hannah went to a festival and she told Reggie Yates that she loved him. Oh. She said, "You smell nice." <laughs> So I'm just changing my foot. I was using a zipper foot earlier. I'm going to be using my quarter of an inch um, foot, which is the one I use all the time, which uh -huh. I absolutely love. So, here. Yeah, I did, I did go to one festival quite a few years ago and it poured with rain and that really put me off. I just sort of thought, actually, I don't really want to do this ever again if the weather's no. horrid. But, you know, we, I think my, my children went and did a... Um, um, a couple of cons uh, a couple of festivals and um, sort of reading festival and, and a, a board masters i think so yeah, yeah. Like, full of sort of teenagers and they had a fantastic oh, time oh yeah Lucci, my uh, godson he goes to all of those and loves it i just don't you know i'm i'm at an age now where i want to know that i've got somewhere to sit <laughs> they said that didn't they i went to a, um we had some we've got some friends that are getting married um, in the summer and they had a joint stag and hen party at the weekend oh yeah and um, we were in a restaurant and um, yeah it was, it was sort of quite you know no crazy shenanigans like you sometimes get at the stag and hen parties uh -huh. it was quite sedate and they were like well you know we're all older we wanted to sit down and be able to talk to each other and I was like oh yeah I, I completely agree with that now but what's the difference between a stag and a hen do together it's a wedding, isn't it? Well, yeah, they, you could argue that. Because yeah. they're all going to be at the wedding. They yeah. wouldn't be invited to the stag do and yeah. then do if you're not going to the wedding. Yeah, yeah. It was, um, you know, and it, it, it wasn't like the um, the hen parties I've been to of yore. Yes. You know. Isn't that the time you're supposed to get out all the angst about the person you're marrying? You yeah. can't do that if you're sitting at the same table. No. You could try. But <laughs> or just very, tell them direct like Hannah does. It was very... It was very exciting for the groom because when we were there, his favourite footballer turned up. Um, not as a, um, you know, not as a, you know, entertainment or yeah, anything else or like or that. Um, no, it was just he just happened to be there, so he was really excited. Oh. And I think, you know, I think that was that was the best part of the whole day. Were well, you at the us. trumpet? Were you local? No, we weren't. We were in Southampton. Oh, okay. It was um, a Southampton footballer that uh -huh. was was there. La trompette. Pardon? So you know all the places, you know, you know all the places nearby me, don't you? Yeah, oh yeah, well, I've, I've been my hangout for the last 20 odd years, probably. Oh no, no, because I've been here for 10 years now, haven't I? But before you that, say yeah. that, but I never, you, we, we never get managed to meet up, do well, we? Well, I've, I've hardly been back since. No. I did, I, I admit I was in Chiswick last week. Oh. 
Well, no, 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 no. Oh, how very rude. No, I was speaking to my friend Nadine because she's leaving uh, London. Oh. So it's going to be the last time. So we'll see. I'll see at Beaconsfield. And where she's moving into a top, two of the top Botox ladies in the country. Oh, really? Yeah. So I said, make friends with them, ship darling, I already know them. Because she lived quite close to me, didn't she? Yeah, yeah. she's in... Um, uh, oh, God, my brain. Terrace. Hang on. Opposite, where's the Soho house? Down there, at that end. Um, yeah. Um, Brackley Terrace. Brack Brackley Terrace. Oh, yeah. yeah. Right, so I've stitched all the way round, apart from these little pieces down here. Um, so you'll see um, on your little booklet, it'll show you here. So this is a bit that I've done. So I've stitched all the way round here, and I've left those little corners free. Um, so it now says, when you're zip open, you bring your right outer panels together, and you're going to sew everything together. Uh -huh. um, so we're going to do that. Um, we're going to get our outer pieces and so this is this little pocket, this little, little pocket, this little, little square um, we're going to put those pieces together and we're going to sew along there like that. so I just pin here and we're just going to stitch this together and I'm going to do exactly the same with the other side and also with the lining Lovely. So she's moving to Beaconsfield? Yeah that's not too far. No, no, she just wants to get out of London. Yeah. Oh, it's a beautiful where she's going. Oh, my word. Is it lovely? It's stunning. Absolutely stunning. One of my friends has moved out to um, a sort of like near, not far from Beaconsfield, sort of Amersham-y kind yeah, of way. Yeah. And um, she sent me a photo of her in the garden and you could just see all these rolling hills. Yeah. If I show her a photograph of my garden, I just see other people's kitchens. Well, Nadine's garden, Nadine lives in a beautiful little house in London. And it's, it's, she wouldn't mind me saying it's tiny. It's absolutely tiny. But the garden is smaller than this table. You can't fit a, a table and chairs in the garden. Yeah. And every house has had their roof, a bedroom put in their roof sort of thing. So they could, every, you can see, be seen from every angle. The only thing that was nice about Nadine's house was nobody in front of it because it was just the end of other people's gardens mm. <coughs> at the front of the house. There was never any anybody there. I think that's the problem with living in a big town, isn't oh, it? Yeah, yeah, you yeah. get that, don't well, you? Well, my house in Twickenham, you couldn't be in a, any room in the house without being seen yeah. by someone else looking in. I'm going to sew that little, rather than leaving this whole piece open, I'm just going to sew there so I can do that little um, tuck yeah. of the bottoms there. And I'll just do that here as well, so it just makes it a little bit easier to finish that all off. But do you live in a little village now? Tiny village, really? tiny little farming village. Yeah. Oh, nice. Mm -hmm. So my, um, my son said to me, you do know you're never allowed to sell this house. Um, you've all, I want to bring my family here um, to this house. And I'm thinking, well, oh, I was hoping that once you'd moved out, I'd be able to go and buy something, you know. <laughs> so it's quite small and, you know, yeah. in the middle of nowhere. I quite like the idea of looking out of the windows and not actually looking into That's all I look out onto is fields oh. there's a, and she, with sheep. And there's a little Norman church just in the, to the right and a little oh. pond, village pond and everything. Sounds idyllic. <coughs> it is. But I do miss, I also miss London. When yeah. I go back to London, I miss London. Yeah. You come and see me. Yeah, That's I will what you do. need to do. So we're just sewing those last little corners. So this is a penultimate one here. Bruce has never been to London for fun. Bruce, you've never lived. Oh. Um, Adam, John, Adam, John, ring the call centre. Ring the call centre, they'll sort it out for you. You've never been to London for fun? Bruce doesn't know what fun oh. is, so. Oh, There's lots of fun to be had. Oh, I oh, love it. <laughs> just being there for two days, I celebrated my birthday early in London with Nadine <coughs> and Francesca, and it was just brilliant to be back. I had, um, yesterday when I went out for my birthday, I went to um, Chinatown for, oh, yeah, for lunch, yeah. which was lovely. I really like going to Chinatown. 
But it's my old stomping ground with there because all the fabric shops yeah. and all the tailors and everything are all around there. It's funny, I went into one of the fabric shops with my mum and there's, under not with my mum, with my daughter, and I said to them, I used to come here when I was a child and they were like, hold on a minute, let's just call up and they, they called the guy that I used to, I remember serving and he remembers me. Oh well, remembers God. remembers my mum, yeah, doesn't really yeah, yeah. remember me. Um, oh, I didn't tell you what I've done there. Yep. And so I've um, sewed those little corners, so I'm still got this gap here, so I'm just going to turn the bag through that gap. Yeah. So obviously, if you're going to be doing this at home, I would sort of trim um, where you've got all of your wadding, um, just to trim that so you've got nice um, sort of sharp um, corners and edges. Um, so you're getting rid of that bulk that's there. Yeah. But obviously for today, we're just going to be doing it like this. So we would want to finish off and just stitch that lining, that gap in that lining. You can do that by hand or you can do that with the machine. I'm just going to tuck that in for the moment. And then you can see how that little bag is. So you've got this little pouch with these little tiny pockets down at the side here. So you can see, I mean, obviously I, I did prep some of it beforehand, but really, really quick for you to do. And um, certainly you'll be able to make you know, a whole set of these in an afternoon. Absolutely. Great, great as a gift and great to sell. As Perfect. Well. Absolutely brilliant. Right. Let me, when are you in next? Oh gosh. Um, after my hot, um, after my holiday, I think. And when's your holiday? Um, 14th of July. No, I must be, I must be in before that. I think I'm in just before that. Okay. 10th. Then. Of July oh well, like sometime in the future. Yeah. Thank you very much indeed. <laughs> right, let's just do a recap then. This bundle here at 59.98. Oh, I haven't got a camera, so I'll show it to that. 59.98. Uh, you buy two, you buy it, you get one for free. Basically, two pay for two, you get one for free. Uh, you've got your perfect pouches. You've got your wash bag wonders, and you've got your box style bags there. So those are the dies you need a Gemini machine to cut those. Gemini machine goes through, you get £100 worth of goodies with it, you get the uh, drunkard's path, <coughs> excuse me, you get the drunkard's path and you get the uh, diamond uh, dies with it, £179.99. Gemini machine, coming up now. Oh, there it is. It's a funny old picture. Okay, and... Hardware in rainbow. So you get two swivel clips, six feet, six D rings, and two handmade signs. $16.97. Should be £22. All in the rainbow. We've also got all of those in rose gold. Six D rings, two swivel clips, two handmade signs, and six feet. Twelve ninety-seven should be nine sixteen ninety-six. The what? Sorry, I couldn't hear. Oh, zips on the roll. Yeah, only a few left though. So do check out. Do check out. Do check out. Got two specials to show you before I go. Oh, broken box. First one is remember these one two three four five from my birthday morning. Five designer fat quarters, completely random. There could be Liberty in there, there could be William Morris, there could be Annie. Who's the one we get muddled up with? What's, hang on, there's two. Annie Downs. Uh, there's uh, uh, Riley Blake in there, William Morris in there. You won't get necessarily get these on here. These are just here to show you all the different varieties that you could get. Lulu, Liberty. Right, £3.79 a fat quarter at the moment, which is brilliant, but that wasn't the price we went to. £2.39 a fat quarter we went to. eleven ninety nine for five designer fat quarters. Completely random. I can mix these up as much as I like because it's just five random designer... Oh, there's a tulip pink. There's a tulip pink there. I know. There's loads and loads and loads of designer fabric in here. You get five, one, two, three, four, five, five fat quarters. One, two, three, four, five. Five fat quarters for eleven pounds and ninety-nine pence. Okay. And the other deal we had on my birthday, which was the best seller until right at the last minute when the torch pipped it at the post. Uh, my 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 or or fill threads. Six threads you get here. Three solid colours. You get the dark turquoise, the lemon, no, the yellow, and the paprika. 
and you get the Marrakesh uh, variegated, you get the pink taffy variegated, and you get the Tamramonto Azoagli. I know they couldn't have just called it orange, could they? 52.99 is how much it's meant to be. Birthday special. 47.99 works out to 61p for 100 meters. Hello, 61p for 100 meters. 47.99 and all the boxes are signed. They come in that gorgeous, lovely box there, presentation box. There are the threads. Egyptian cotton taken to Italy, created into the most beautiful, powerful, strong thread. 50 weight, 1300 meters on each spool. Ah, no. Right, have we got two menus? Oh, winner from a birthday. Who won the iron? <laughs> Vera Jordan, you don't get another one. Don't worry, Vera. All we do is we just credit your account for 28 99 the amount it cost. So what the idea was, you bought one and one of you would get it for free. That's Vera. Right. My menu for tomorrow, uh, that's today, that's it, that's today. Becky Swansea, not in again tomorrow. No, I'm, I'm up. I'm Two up seconds. TV. Yeah. yeah. Do Hobby Maker then, what's coming up next to Hobby Maker? You sure that's today now? Are you going in there to do Gemini Mini Dies with Debbie Robinson? Isn't that yesterday as well? Neo Stamp launch at two o'clock. Sarah Signature Dancing Dragonfly with Debbie Robinson. Oh, no, I've seen Debbie outside. Yeah, yeah she's in. Cosmic Shimmer Glossy Glaze with Jamie from Creative Expressions. Sharon Callis Craft returns at five o'clock. That's what's coming up in Hobby Maker in about two minutes' time. Here is tomorrow. Eight and... Oh, hang on, I'm a bit confused. Eight o'clock is Village Fabric Block of the Month. 9 and 10 is Stuart. Is that way he's doing? Oh, okay. 11, Yvonne McAtamney doing the shelf edge dresser runner. And 12 o'clock, this is nothing like I've put on my website. Brother, brother sewing and embroidery machines with Stuart Hillard. So why are we doing it like that? I don't know. <laughs> I don't know. Anyway, uh, thank you very much, thank Becky. Thank you, nice and, to see you. And you. And I will see you tomorrow morning at 8 o'clock. Go and watch Hobby Maker now at 1 o'clock. Join us for an amazing week of early bird specials. From Monday the 20th of June, we're bringing you some fantastic bargains with bigger quantities and better prices. Join us every day this week from 8am so you don't miss these special deals. Have you heard about all the different ways you can shop on Sewing Street? You can shop on our website, sewingstreet.com, and you can also order by phone by calling our friendly UK customer service team. Just call 0800 001 4433. And don't forget about the Sewing Street app. Here you can shop all of the Sewing Street products as well as watch the live shows from anywhere. You can download the app onto your smartphone or your tablet by simply searching Sewing Street in your app store. And one final thing, no matter how many times you check out on Sewing Street in one day, you will only pay one postage and packaging. Happy shopping! Missed the live show? Don't worry, we recorded it for you. Never miss out on your favourite presenters, guests and makes ever again. Head on over to our YouTube pages to watch back the day's live show and enjoy your favourite demos over and over again. We also have lots of great content exclusive to our YouTube pages, such as product demonstrations, troubleshooting videos and so much more. Subscribe and turn on the bell notification so you never miss a show or video ever again. We know that shopping online can be a confusing and sometimes daunting task. And sometimes all you want to do is talk to a human being. Our family-run customer service team are on call 24-7. Full of friendly, warm-hearted individuals, all trained to make your shopping experience as easy and enjoyable as possible. 
Not only will they take your order, they'll also help and guide you on your shopping journey, so you never miss out. Are you a fan of Sewing Street and Yarn Lane? Why not join our growing Facebook fans pages? Just search Sewing Street Fans and Yarn Lane TV Fans on Facebook and click Join Group. It's that simple. Never miss out on the latest news and updates from our presenters and guest designers, special offers and plenty of chat with your fellow fans. Share photos of your mates, ask for advice, interact with your favourite guests and presenters and be a part of the ever-growing sewing and yarn community. See you there! a sewing street or yarn lane customer no matter how many times you check out in one day you will only pay one postage and packaging so don't wait to add the item you want to your basket and check out you will only pay one pmp even if you check out multiple times in one day